Are we here now? Can y'all hear me? Holy shit, everything broke at once. The game, then when I fixed it, the internet broke instantly right after that. <laughs> Freaking chaos. Anarchy. We see, we hear, hell yeah. Okay, good, good. It was good, I haven't played it for almost three years. The last time I played it was my first stream ever. Oh, nice! It's awesome. Glad you're liking it. Let me open this again. <laughs> oh. I don't think I got to change scene. Gonna have to wait a little bit. Zero is one that I've always been... Kind of... Doing the Wesker mode? What is that? Oh, we're gonna have to do all of this again. Oh my god. I've done this section of the game three times now. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. There's something weird. Wow. Is replaced with Wesker and Rebecca has a new outfit. Oh, wait, but is this like a mod or like an actual thing? Because that sounds pretty neat. Uh, oh, we're ready. Talk to family. Okay, this is fine with you. That was strange. The monsters are so... I don't really know what word to use. Agitated? It's an actual thing you unlock after finishing the game. Oh, nice! On our walk to the market, Charles spun a tale about how he fended off a raging bow run from destroying his farm. At first, I thought he was boastful, but yeah. now I'm not so sure. Oh, wait! Tubby! <laughs> Sorry. Uh... How did you like the the announcement of the Resident Evil 4 remake? What do you think? I'm pretty freaking excited for that shit. I, I feel a bit weird about them seemingly changing how Ashley looks quite a bit. I'm not a fan of them recasting the whole uh, voice cast. Which I guess, like, it's been almost 20 years, I guess it makes sense. Especially if maybe some of the actors aren't around, or they're retired, or their voices have changed too much. Whatever. Uh, but this makes me a bit sad, because I thought the voices were pretty freaking great in RE4. And I feel like they didn't find great replacements. Like, I, I heard Salazar speak, or not Salazar, uh... Sadler speaking, I was like, this does not sound an eighth as threatening as older Sadler. <laughs> Simon's dad does love to exaggerate. But otherwise, I'm super excited. Want to see more? True, but Simon mentioned the attack yesterday. I don't think this is one of Charles's tall tales. So what's this have to do with the market's goods? I can't say for sure, but these monsters concern me. Their behavior is tumultuous at the best of times, and now they're more ferocious than ever. I wouldn't be surprised to learn they've been evolving. Hmm. Yeah, the timing is definitely suspicious. Plus, we haven't noticed anything weird with the grain Simon's brought over. So, only the monster meat has changed. That's what we're thinking. Mina, huh. you got the sharpest senses out of all of us. Take a closer look at these ingredients for us, will you? Okay. I hate to admit it, but I've been neglecting my responsibilities these past few days. You don't need to tell us that. No offense, sleepyhead. It's okay, Mina. Get the stove going, and let's do some tests. 
Oh! Make a dish. More ingredients are available. So now some of the tiles break. Hmm, it doesn't taste too different at first, but when overmixed, it begins to sour. Oh! What the heck? Oh, whoa? Oh, no, this is... if we mix those. Shit! I don't know what to do. And what about these purple spots? You see them? They're popping as we cook. Gross! We didn't actually serve this to customers, did we? Oh no! So are the are the the monsters get sick or something? No way we did. This must be from spoiling within the past day. Maybe. Ugh. There's definitely a foulness to the taste now. I've never in my life seen this before. Well, you certainly seem calm. Didn't you inspect the produce before buying? Aww. Pointing fingers isn't going to help anything. Ma, pa. I think we should look at what Mina brought in from the garden earlier. Hmm. They're just as bad even though they're from our backyard. Then it might not be the Brigadier's fault. That just leaves a problem with the monsters themselves. How could this happen? I 
I'm not sure, but we'll have to be extra careful from now on. When you took the right precautions, it seemed like the poison dissipated. It'll take more time to prep ingredients, but it's time I'm willing to take to ensure our food is safe. Oh. Are we going to be able to open up again? Let's keep testing our recipes tomorrow, and then we'll see. Good work, Mina. I'm going to talk to the rest of the village leaders about our discovery. Yeah, good work, Mimi. If there's nothing else to do here, I need to get back to Alex and make sure he's alright. Okay. Mina, you and I should keep going for a little while longer. I have a few more ideas. Alright, Ma. Let's keep cooking. Interesting. So said also a letter from Thrash. I wonder if he's made it in yet. <gasps> oh. Uh also, yeah, if you think you're game for the raid, uh follow Tabitha. Streaming a bunch of Resident Evil, some DPD, some Batman. Uh and as for me, I'm gotten I used to stream things. Seven ESD, whatever day I'm able to. <laughs> Currently, most days. Uh, and uh, yeah, thank you, Tavi. Appreciate you. If you need to go do something else, rest, have some food, whatever it is, please feel free to do so. Don't feel like you need to stick here. I appreciate you. Enjoy your lurk. Artie is sick. <gasps> Kieran's making an antidote, and there's some place called the Dark Realm. What? And I'm at home worrying about spoiled meat and sick customers. It's kind of weird that everyone's getting sick at the same time. I wonder if this monster problem reaches farther than Windy Village. I should look at as many cuts of monster as I can tomorrow. Maybe there's some way I can help. Dear Thrash. Hmm. Also, yeah, we're... I'm going to gather some ingredients, Ma. We just finished Prey a few days ago. Two days ago. On Sunday, yes. Uh, and we're taking a break to play this game, Battleship Brigade. Lovely game. Uh, about hunting monsters and using resources from the wild along with like monster meat and stuff. Uh, to make different dishes for a competition. Uh, which we were banned out of. <laughs> so we're in the aftermath of that. Uh, and this may be the last stream of that until after we finish the next game, which will be Dead Space, which we may start tonight, depending on where we get to in this. Thank you, dear. Told you she just needed to keep working. I know my daughters. Sure, Ma. Sure. <laughs> Come here, Chimkin. Oh. Oh, that egg didn't look too great. <laughs> As a matter of fact, it was kind of scary. <laughs> Dang it. There we go. The doors are open. Let's get to it. Guess I'll have to test these after the lunch rush. Oh shit, let's go. Um fire. Oh, here we go. Fire in the nerves. Donkey. Oh. Uh. Actually, I just need to put this here. Yes. you to finish up that Karana pancake dish for me would you dad said the other restaurants are doing better with their ingredients since we did our demonstration for them two century egg appetizers Mina 
But the pickings are slim. We need to avoid the purple splotched meats for now. People are still getting sick from it. So, looks like we'll be limited on our ingredients till we figure things out. I mean, may as well do that. Oops. Um. There we go. Oh, <laughs> perfect. Uh, need fire here. Have fire. Earth and fire. Oh, that looks great. Water, fire, water, fire, water. Thanks. Okay, that's pretty good. I'm proud of you, Mina. Our menu will still have to cut down on quite a few recipes until this is sorted out, but we couldn't have reopened without you. Thanks, Ma. I'm going to keep doing more experiments tonight. Maybe I'll find out even more? We'll all stick around and help. Alex is still feeling kind of sick and doesn't want to eat very much. He's sticking to vegetables for now. Maybe you two can teach me something to serve him. <laughs> Have you made him my signature dumpling soup yet? Ooh. Ma, that dish is only for when we're serious. You know that. I don't know if it's because he's sick, but I'm not sure if he wants to start going steady. Well, hurry up. Wow. Your father and I aren't getting any younger. Ma. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, this one's from Kieran. Mina, I've only slept four and a half hours in the last five days, so forgive me for being terse. Whoa. After my work on Thrash's antidote, Belchior asked me to work with him on a new brigade assignment. They've tasked us with identifying and containing a possible monster mutation. The samples I've taken are concerning. I don't wish to engage in speculation before my tests are complete, but I think there's more going on here than they suspect. So the monsters are acting weird everywhere. A mutation, though? Isn't that just a blight? Hmm. If that's true, Kieran and Thrash will need all the help they can get. I've got to tell her everything I know. Yes. Kieran, I hope this letter doesn't come too late. But I've been seeing issues with the monsters here, too. Chee -chee. Hey, what's going on? You're looking much better, Simon. Ugh, still just on broth right now. What's the deal with the letter? It's from the Brigade. Based on the findings of our top researchers, we regret to inform the populace that Bictusia is facing a potentially catastrophic monster mutation event. Damn! Due to the severity of the outbreak, we're putting all able-bodied battle chefs on full alert. We've isolated the problematic traits and determined that all monsters are not yet affected. But our investigation is ongoing. Oh. Our primary focus must switch to containing this outbreak. To that end, the Proving Tournament will be put on hold until the situation is under control. Okay, so the tournament is on hold. So are we gonna do something to help stop this issue? Or fix it? Or find a workaround or something? And that will allow us to get back into it, maybe? This must be the outbreak Kieran mentioned. Maybe it really is a blight? Jeez. This sounds serious. Shh, listen. The contestants have all been offered the opportunity to temporarily work with the brigade in containing the situation. We'd like to request the aid of Mina Han <gasps> back at the capital. Oh shit! Oh my goodness. They want us back! Given the circumstances, we are willing to revoke the proving tournament expulsion once the festivities resume. Oh shit! Let's go! With your help, we hope this incident will be resolved as quickly as possible. So due to emergency needs, they're like, hey, you're probably good enough to help us with this in some way, shape, or form. So we'll we'll remove the the two-year ban. The Pog. Is fully yours, and we hope to hear from you soon. Stay safe and break a dish. The tournament committee. Hell yeah! We have to go back. Absolutely not. You lost that privilege the moment you ran off with our money. This is no longer about fun and games. The capital sounds way too dangerous right now, not to mention the roads. That's exactly why I should be there. I have a chance to do something good for once in my life. Oh, Mimi. Before I was careless. I was bored. I was only thinking about myself. I didn't earn my place in the tournament. I stole it from the people who taught me the skills I was so desperate to prove. 
deserve anything. Mina, you need to calm down. You two made this place with your bare hands. You gave Saskia and I opportunities we couldn't get anywhere else. Opportunities I took for granted. But now there's a way I can help you. A way I can make it up to you. By fixing the monster problem at its source. Hell yeah! If I can find out what's going on, I can bring that knowledge back and make sure no one gets sick again. And we can keep serving customers like before. Well, oh. I promise I'll write home this time. Going to be okay. I'll be in the hands of the veteran battle chefs. I'm sorry, but you're still grounded. Stealing our flower money? That's a serious crime. <laughs> but I my baby girl, how are you ever going to survive out there if you don't understand sarcasm? <laughs> oh my god! What huh? I can't keep you here any more than I can keep the wind from blowing through the trees. Kiki, what's happening right now? <laughs> Your mother is letting you go. We all are. Only the brigade can stop what's happening. The best way to help the restaurant is to join them. Let's go! Oh, thank you, Ma! Huh? Kiki! Thank you! Woohoo! I mean, carry on, Han family. Don't mind me. <laughs> I'm going to help stop this monster mess. Then I'm coming right back to the restaurant. No, you're not. This is our family's iron pan, passed <gasps> down for generations. And you been! My mother gave it to me when I left home to create this restaurant with your father. It's time for you to have it. The combo ban? <gasps> Multiple promotes done quickly activate magic that further enhances flavors? What the fuck is this? Oh, oh shit. You are who you are, Mina, and that person needs to help others. I didn't want to let you go before. But I won't make the same mistake twice. I couldn't be prouder of the woman you've become. Oh! And I couldn't be happier to be part of this family. I'm so sorry for the way I acted before. This is too sweet! Everyone stumbles, Mina. It's how you get up that matters. It's time to stop feeling sorry for yourself and keep your chin up, okay? But don't think we're not going to tease you for all the moping. I just have <laughs> out of my mind. <laughs> I don't know. You definitely were mopey Mina. No, mopey poo. <laughs> I was not. Fine, maybe a little. Drink your water, Simon. You're still dehydrated. <laughs> oh, chapter three complete. Nice. Gail. Brigade Town. This place is bustling. You can't really imagine the capital from what travelers say. You have to be here and experience it. Mm -hmm. I'll definitely be experiencing all the cuisine. Too bad about the meat, though. <laughs> Maybe your dad will finally stop telling you to put on weight. Oh, that'll be the day. I'm still surprised we convinced him to let me come with you. I'd say your client expansion argument was pretty clever. <laughs> especially since you made it up on the spot. It's silly, but your speech to your family made me feel like it was time to try something new. Look at you getting all mushy. <laughs> yeah, well, you can pay me back with a restaurant tour. Deal. But first, we should check out the inn. And then I need to find Thrash and Kieran. Yes. Oh, you brought a friend. How nice. I have your rooms all ready. Let me take your bags up. Oop. Okay, there's something I haven't told you. You chew on your pillow at night. Everyone knows that, Mina. <laughs> no, that's not even true. Did Kiki tell you that? <laughs> Never mind. Anyway, you can't tell anyone this. Thrash, Kieran, and I have been looking into the monster epidemic. Now that I'm back, we're going to try to find the cause. Mm -hmm. Do you want to help? Nah. You're not even going to think about it? Mina, you have always had these grand ambitions. Me, though? I just want to grow the family business and go back to a peaceful life of talking to wheat stalks. I guess I knew that. But I wish we could tag team this. I know. Just make sure you're back before dinner. I want to try that crescent place. <sighs> this guy thinks we're on vacation. <laughs> Gragmore, you may know. Oh god, the food in this still looks so great. Blue 
Blue Jay. Blue Jay. Oh, let me check something. Make sure I didn't forget. Oh yeah, I, yeah, I did set the pink. For whatever reason, I was wondering if I put the thing on Discord. Nina, it's wonderful to see you. Kieran, fresh. I missed you guys so much. We missed you too. Now, down to business. Down to business. We don't have time to go into detail, but Thrash and I have been through a lot since you've been gone. Since you've been gone. Too much for my taste. The bandits, the antidote, the dark realm. It sounds terrifying. Trust me, it's as bad as it sounds. Oh no. The positive side is that we've garnered new insights on this mutation. Causation is still unclear, but the monsters and Ardia's sickness seem to be correlated. Hmm. I think we could be on the verge of a full-scale blight. How did you figure it out? That was all you, BJ. We got your letters, and Kieran ran some tests. Sure enough, the blood she took from Ardia had similar properties to the mutated monsters. Hmm. Precisely. Which could mean that a modified version of her antidote might cure the monsters themselves. Kieran, you're a genius! That remains to be seen. The cure is purely speculative at this stage. Hmm. So, what's our next move? I think we should report to our stations and see what the Brigade needs from us. We don't have anything concrete to show them yet, but we can get more samples for Kieran to test. Agreed. It's our wisest course of action. What do you think, Mina? I'm with you all the way. All right, we should go. Let's meet up again when we have more info. Brace slaps our tail. Okay, okay, first of all, we gotta replace this pan for the better pan. Also, what is this? Oh, the thing is spicy sauce. Yes. Yes, yes, yes. Uh, I think that's it. Oh, back again. Yeah, a lot's happened since I left. How's business? Occupancy suffering from tremens inter interruption. I'm afraid. Wait, no, I'm missing. I'm mixing. I think I, I mixed it with Caesar's voice I was using. <laughs> it's, it's been too long. I need to listen to him actually speak to remember. The missus can even cook for our guests until this chaos is resolved. Don't worry, don't worry, sir. I'm sure we'll have an answer soon. <gasps> Who the fuck's this? Kind of scared to it now. I heard people are getting sick left and right. I guess it's just berries for me. <gasps> Wait, where's Louis and Louis? Curious. I hope they're not sick. Well, good day to you. So how long is this tournament delay going to be? I was only planning to stay in the capital for months. Oh, oh my god, what the fuck is this? Okay. She has big Aerith vibes. <laughs> the veteran battle chefs matched through town, marched through town the other day. They were so cool, I didn't even realize that we were here because of the monster problem. Briefing time. Mm -hmm. Shit. Chefs, welcome. Thank you for coming on such short notice. Your loyalty to the Brigade and to Victusia has been noted. Despite the public's concern, I have every confidence this outbreak can be managed and will be able to resume the proving tournament <laughs> soon. Hey, nice. How you doing? Not once in a hundred years has the tournament been cancelled. I won't be the first chairman to let that happen. What if I don't want a nerd? Here to explain I'm your mission I will. and provide more information on the outbreak is Instructor Razzle. Instructor, if you would. Razzle, dazzle. Good afternoon, chefs. We've learned that a rapidly spreading virus hey, nice. is mutating monsters across Victusia. <sighs> Just finished food? Whoa. So, you're gonna be playing more DVD? 
<laughs> There's been a stark increase what in you have? population and dangerous ingredients. Then I'm pretty hungry. However, thanks to volunteers such as yourselves, these monsters have not been able to cause severe damage in our cities and towns. But the same can't be said for the ingredients that make their way into people's homes. From what we know, the ingredients are safe as long as we take the proper precautions and prepare uh, them. Fish. But that hypothesis requires more testing. Nice. We're fully staffed here in the Coliseum, so our unproven squads will be using the practice kitchen area. Wow. I'm surprised you're even remotely thinking of Fortnite, since you were so into DVD and there's the new killer and stuff. Or is it, is it maybe that you just want to play DVD with me? The uh -huh. uh -huh. <laughs> That's all for now. Kraus will lead you to your stations where you'll receive further instruction. We do forklift is pretty fun as well. Are you gonna be playing with Sims? Is that right? <laughs> oh, looks like even Shiv got a call back. I was dreaming of what? What was the dream? You've been, you've been having some wild ass dreams. I really want to play DVD with you. <laughs> oh my god. Hold up a second. This. <laughs> I. God damn it. Hold up a sec. So this is... Wait, let me check my Discord so I'm consistent with my own stuff. <laughs> uh... And there we go. What did that not work? Is it go down? God damn it. But please. Oh yeah, it's quote Anne. Yes, there we go. Perfect. Uh sorry, yeah, you were saying? That I was playing for it, that was just a dream? You were just playing Fortnite in your dream? <laughs> I mean, that's... that's fair. Very fair. <laughs> you have to be kidding me. Oh, hey, Shiv. I... Save it. Don't think you're important enough to hold a grudge about. I'm here to get back in and take everyone down. Every what? last... One. Wait, wait, wait. This is important. This is very important. What skin were you wearing in the... were you using in the dream? You mean in terms of the tournament, right? These new poisonous and moldy ingredients are perfection. <laughs> oh my god. And how many Piki Royales did you get? I will be very proud and or disappointed based on the answers. I need them. You're not serious, are you? <laughs> <laughs> All right, Sea Squad babies, listen up. <laughs> I almost tried talking out loud, thinking we're on call. <laughs> the sorry lot of you make up every oh person God. that was kicked out of the tournament for one reason or another. <laughs> That's because you're never here. The only time you listen to my to my voice is because we are on call. You're not used to it, nerd. <laughs> that cute skin? Oh, the... The, like, summer one? With the orange pants? Or the snap one. The committee's decided to let you back in. But you'll have to earn it. Mm, I'm ready! Oh Decide my god. Nothing's going to stop me! Don't worry, committee! I won't let you down! <laughs> it's true though, yeah. <laughs> I know. It, I just couldn't contain myself. 
We'll run this mission just like a tournament match. I'll pair you one on one for cook offs. <gasps> oh. Every dish must contain at least one ingredient from a mutated monster. That's our theme for the day. You'll each have to make three dishes. Yeah, they're both in the battle pass. One for Belchior and one for Kraus. There's like a fuck ton of battle pass skins. Actually, there was a change to the briefing. I'm, I'm still getting over a little bug. Oh no. All right, make that two dishes. Okay. Uh. So this is still good to try, I think. Combo bonus. Further enhances flavor. I'd love to see an emphasis on fire energy for these tests. It would really help my research. And make that a water dish for me. Preferably one that'll fix this headache. Okay. Oh. Fire and water. Okay. And it has to be from sick animals. It's an angry boy. Eat that. Fuck it. Let's start with the water thing. Uh. Put this here. Oh, if we need fire, I know where to get some fire. Oh, my God. Fire. Dragon steak. It has some earthy. This has to be of like all everything. Let's put this here and mix. This and Okay, I did want something fiery, so never mind. Uh, let's put this here. Get rid of that. You come in here. Uh, I mean, yeah, that's fine, I guess. I need to add some water to this. I guess I don't have more water. <laughs> I need to run and look in it. Fuck off, get out of here. <laughs> ah! Damn, that's not good enough. Okay, this has some water. I need more eggs. Oh, this is perfectly good too. That egg doesn't think. Another egg. <gasps> yes, more sauce. Uh, 
Um, 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 um. So let me put this here and this here. And we're gonna do this and we're gonna do this. Hog! Now we're gonna do this. Put this here, put this here, and start warming up so it gets even more watery. Um, so now I want more fire ingredients. Aha, uh -huh, get right, nerd. Oh god. Fire sauce or something? I may do. No, I don't think I do actually. Um let's add this and then do this. We can add a bone here. I need that is not what I wanted to do, but let me take it. Oh, we can do this and do this. Oh, that's very pog. Uh. What do... what else do I do? Oh, actually, we can do this. Actually, I may want to get rid of this. So it only upgrades the fire one. In the time we have. Uh... We can add this here, so we can do this, and we can add the other two, so we can do this. Oh, it doesn't work that way. Oh shit. Well, we can do this. <laughs> okay, this is the water dish for her. And this is the fire dish for him. <gasps> ah! Okay, I think we fucking Let's destroyed we this match, here. actually. <laughs> Naruto rooting. Naruto rooting. Rooting? Running looking ass. Hell yeah. And then throw cool nice and shit. Tornadoes? I'm so sick. Yes, I'm curious to dissect these dishes. <gasps> Oh my god, okay, she did the... the... Yes! Oh, we're doing this one first. Sun Hat Tomato Curry, served with Chip Chi Beast, or Breast, and Sun Hat Tomato Assortment. That looks amazing. Ooh, excellent! This is the precise amount of fire I require for my experiments. Pretty good, but it has poison in it. <laughs> Blech! Perhaps I was not clear that all the portions should be edible? This dish is ruined by the poison in it. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay, Such mine destroys skill. that. Barbecue dragon shank with a side of dragon steak and dragon heart melange. Oh my god, look at this shit. It looks so good. With a little egg. Oh my god. Excellent. This is the precise amount of fire required for my experiments. 
Hey, hey God! I've had trouble keeping this one away from the cats. Surprised they haven't come running yet. 300 points, damn! That's twice as much as hers, pretty much. They could love Jamun, oh my god. With a side of sun hat tomato and Karania stomach assortment. The water, I think it cured my. No, headaches back. Poison? I get the hint. Oh my god. Yes, good. Karan and Karania nectar shaped ice. Holy shit, that looks amazing too. With a side of X and King Bean assortment. The water, I think it. Nope. <gasps> Incredible, you've managed to impress me. Holy shit, we got over twice as many points as her! Hit Ragnar! Looks like the winner is Mina Flan. Flan? <laughs> I hate to contradict, but I believe it's Han. Hmm. Her name is smudged on the roster. Han, then. Fuck yeah, let's go! Oh my god, almost exactly twice as many points. We needed four more points. After winning a couple of these by, like... I think... The previous two we won by two and three points difference in a row. <laughs> I'll fucking take it. This is amazing. I finally found my my group. Had some fine work, C Squad. I did some chemical readings on your dishes, and I didn't see anything to be alarmed by. We might see some effects on the body in years to come, but hey, as a country, we've been eating monster for a century now. It's the way of the brigade. Hell yeah. All right, head back to town. For the half of you that lost, don't fret. We'll be back at it tomorrow. You may have won this cute little game of theirs, but I'm saving my best for when the real cooking starts. Uh, sure thing, honey. I wouldn't expect any less. So it's true. Why? They did make a sea squad, and it's filled with the bottom of the barrel. Who the fuck are you, nerd? Who's this not white? I have no idea. I'll never forget. When you cut me in line during registration! Oh my god, I remember this fucking nerd. And I know that I had the exact same fucking reaction the first time I played this game now. Oh my god, I remember this whiny boys. Oh, that. I <laughs> remember now. I told you I'd be watching. I knew karma would bite you back, and then you got kicked out fighting that sore loser over there. <laughs> the brigade may show you mercy, but I'm not going to be so lax. It's not why it sounds right. <laughs> I've got to get back to B-Squad. I have an important mission to carry out, but I just had to see what the stink was all about. Hmm. Hmm. <laughs> Anyways, I gotta go. Later, Girl Scout. What? I guess I've made some enemies, too. <laughs> Karana Stomach Mapo Tofu. Hmm, I love this game. Oh! <sighs> it's too quiet out here at night. I never thought I'd see Brigade Town so empty. Actually, I think I have a stream. I was thinking... If I ever streamed, um... Cook server delicious, but I think I have. It may have been on Discord though. Huh. <gasps> Ziggy! Sorry for the fright. I just like to make an entrance. You don't look very sorry. I thought you were a monster. <laughs> what are you doing out here? You're not a part of C Squad. Just checking on something that couldn't wait till morning. What's your excuse? <laughs> I actually volunteered for this shift. I want to do everything I can to find the cause of this monster mutation. Is that so? Oh my god, look at the left on the window. I somehow did not notice this before. <gasps> First of all, there's a cat with a bow tie. And it's the cutest shit in the universe. But second, left from it, a bit less noticeably, there's just the biggest little chunky cat. It's like, oh well, I love you. <laughs> I I'm weak. I love them. Let's have a practice duel soon. Two night owls like us. I think we can learn a lot from each other. Okay, yeah.
Oh, few days gone by. Okay. There has to be some way to figure out this monster problem. Thresh said he had a morning duel today, but I bet Kieran's at Belkior's. I need to get over there and see how I can help. Yes, Belkior. Oh. Right up. <laughs> Still jumpy, eh? I wouldn't be if you'd stop sneaking up on me. Fair enough. So about that match today. Let me know when you're ready. <laughs> I've totally forgotten with everything else going on. Trust me, you're going to want to remember this one. Catch you later. Oh. Did you enjoy the very service this morning? It was delicious. It did make me wonder how many dishes I could make with just berries. Hmm. Oh, so the oh, so everything's back. Nice. Oh wait, not everything. Where's Pontida? It's back. Curious. There's a note from Pontida. For the first time in, for the first time in ten years, the Crescent has decided not to open its doors for dinners. We'll resu we'll resume service as soon as all staff members are briefed on proper handling of mutated monster meat. Ooh. Oh, that's right, because it's a restaurant. Just say the word and we'll have the practice kitchen. Oh, look at the little doggo. Hey, boy. Hey, how you doing? Hello. Oh, can I pet the doggo? No. Simon. Hey, Mina. Well, if it isn't my sister at arms. Hey, guys. What are you guys doing together? This guy is my first customer. I saw him selling pastries this morning and couldn't put, put them down. And with Simmons Green, they'll be even better. That's flower power, baby. <laughs> awesome, I can't wait to try all the sweets. It's gonna hunt. So you've returned. Whoa, yeah. I didn't think you'd notice. Not you. I was talking to that very persistent fly who likes to land on my babies. <laughs> babies? <sighs> my trophies. Oh my god. How sweet? Uh oh. Hunt five ingredients in a lot of time. Oh god. The girl with the walking kettle, right? Um, no, I mean a Han. Walking kettle? Oh, I think I remember what she's talking about. Any news? Our things. Hey, Mina, I think you'll find today's item particularly cool. If not, I'll leave my belt. That's not necessary, please don't. Thank you, Mina. If you're big on reading, unlike my brother here. We've got several fascinating tomes. Louis is the bookworm, but even I know they can give you an edge in battle. Awesome, we'll check them out. So, does it say what's new? Oh, <gasps> purifying oven! A Belkir original! This prototype is rare, but may contain trace amounts of cat hair. Or hearthy oven. A blend of magical gastronomy and technology. Kirin would love this. Oh! Apprentice expertise. Saucier. So this is for extra points. I don't know if I care a lot about that. But this... Safely triggers poison and bone. It's very good. Huh. Would this mean we can just cut? Hmm. Maybe replace the cutting board for this and have this other oven so we can have multiple things cooking at the same time? I'm intrigued by the prospect. If anything, either of these will be useful 
replacement for the basic oven, so... Oh wait, no, this is different! This is... this just gets rid of the poison and bone. It doesn't... promote the gems. Hmm... I feel like I do maybe still want it. Instead of the cutting board. Let's try it. Why not? Dragon Steak Why, Curry. My faithful assistant. I was hoping you'd answer the brigade's call. Really? But you had Kieran all this time. What's the old adage? Too many cooks might spoil the broth, but many chefs make light work. Oh shit. I somehow messed that up. Uh. <laughs> hey, we did it! That was hard. Um. Oh shit. Oh, there we go. Okay, we do this, and then we do that. Nice. Oh god. I'm guessing I'm supposed to just roll this? Oop. I... Oh, I guess I have to remove the bones as well, because they don't. I wouldn't have any extra bones. Okay, now we do this. Oh, the water could have technically done the thing, I guess. This does that, that does this. Seventy-six, nice. I love these little puzzles. They're so neat. I left, we made so much progress. Did you figure out how to make ambrosia? No. With mounting suspicion about the monster threat, the brigade requested I find a cure. But now that we've discovered it can be safely prepared, surely that takes some pressure off. Quite right. I'm certain we'll discover both solutions very soon. Hell yeah. Is there anything else that was... Not really, I kind of maybe want this oven, but I don't know. Alright, I have to do the duel. But wait, who's going to judge the match? Jelly, of course, who else? Blub. Okay, let's try the new oven. Your funeral. It get rid gets rid of the poison instead of having the cutter. Which will mean we can't put a lot of stuff we don't need. Because we can't just remove it now, but should be fine. Before we start, I have a confession. I started the monster plague. What? Y you? Psych! Just kidding. But I do know what's causing it. What? What? Really? Well, mostly. That's where you come in. If you're serious, 
I'm happy to help however I can. <laughs> That's exactly what I needed to hear. Ready, Jelly? He's going to judge? How does he eat? Probably with his mouth. <laughs> oh my god, I love him. Jelly says he'd die for some fire and earth. So let's serve it up. Oh. So it has to be a perfect mix of fire and the earth. Theme ingredient, let's do King Bee. Oh. I love that. Okay, let's go. Okay, we have to find the giant beans. Very appropriate for this drum. No! Bird! Fuck off! Why did you take my fucking thing? I will fucking murder you! Oh my god, another one. There we go. Give me my fucking shit. So we put this first. Uh, this I need to have a lot of. And let's put this and let's put like this. Now let me get rid of that poison. And I'm gonna need more fire ingredients and I know just where to get them. Oh, and more potatoes. Fuck you! Oh my god, I fucking hate these birds. Give me my fucking potato! No! I fucking hate this game. Still my fucking taters. Holy shit, these birds are fucking on the prowl for my shit. And every time we die, we lose some progress. Shit. Um. Why is it doing it on the water one? Oh my god, does it always work that way? Oh my god, it's it's fucking decided it has to be the water one. I lost so much time because I died twice. Damn it. I have to serve this. I don't have another option. Damn it. Bean brains? Oh my god. With a side effects and squeakle tentacle balance. Cool. Blah, 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 blah. Well, we lost. It's 
it's mostly just spicy. Damn it! I forgot to. Hmm. This could have been so much better. Ugh. Rematch, yes! Oh, nice! Okay, so. I, I wasn't sure if there was gonna be like a consequence or not for losing. Shit, I wasn't expecting it to pop off instantly. I, I need to drink. Remember the hydrate chat? Hydrate or dehydrate. Okay, there we go. Let's try, we need the green bean. Or the, the bean. Whatever. Oh, fucking. Oh, shit. Um, um, um. Awesome. So let's put this here. We can put that there. So that's gonna make those fire bone things into something else. And in that short time, I mostly just want to get like one of these. Oh, and another tater, sure. Oh, it did both. Nice. So we're gonna do that. And we're gonna do this. So that's perfectly just as fire and earthy as it has to be. So if we can add like this. get rid of the poison and then find something else that has oh tomatoes the tomatoes have earth and fire I think this may work Actually, wait. If I had enough, I just need one more tomato. One more, one more, one more. That's gonna save me a lot of time. Shit, dude! Fuck off! Damn it! Holy fuck, that bull is fucking pissed off! Okay, I'm gonna do that so I can get that out of the way. I'm gonna do this so I can put this here. Oh, if it doesn't upgrade the... I don't think it will do it in time. So you have four and four. I kind of don't want to do it. Uh, let me add some more of this. Let's get cooking. Just for extra points. Oh, and I can do this and this. There we go. Okay, that's as good as it's gonna get. Woo! Okay, that was way better. <laughs> Holy shit, what the fuck did he do? Oh, that looks amazing! Very Radwurst? 
with a side of Boron Ribs and Dragon Shanks assortment. Holy shit! That's amazing! Bloop. Blah, 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 blah. Dragon Steak Curry, garnished with King Bean and Dragon Shank Medley. <laughs> Fuck yes, we win! <laughs> I love the fucking Jetta Ghost. <laughs> Dragon steak curry, hell yeah. Oh my Sorry god, I'm so hungry. This isn't a real blight, it's man made. <gasps> what? Who would do something that horrible? <laughs> Who indeed? On purpose, it would be too much for most people to stomach. But covering up an accident? That's a little easier on the conscience. Hmm. But there's only one way to find out breaking into the brigade's research lab. What? Do you want to be imprisoned? How can you think it's their fault with how hard they're trying to fight it? I started with some scraps of information from this body I'm possessing. But once I showed up here, solving this problem turned out to be a lot more complicated than I hoped. Ziggy... If you're just going to keep making jokes, I've got to get back to town. People's lives are at stake. I'm not joking. Whoa! This is the real me. <laughs> Stop playing around! What the fuck? I'm not proud of the things I did to get here. I want to stop this outbreak. I don't need help breaking into the lab, but I can't bring the information I find to the brigade. They don't trust me. But you, I know how determined you are to get to the bottom of this. You're not just in it for the tournament reinstatement. Help me end this. I don't know what to make of your stories, but I do want to put an end to the outbreak. So his theory is that someone fucked up and messed up by experimenting something in the monsters and then they created this blight as a way to cover it up in the meantime while they try to fix it? So he thinks it's the brigade that did it? Maybe? To hmm. be honest, I've been meeting with Kieran and Thrash about it already. She's working on a cure. A cure? Well, that would be interesting. So what do you say? After you get the information, come find us. I'm against the break-in, but this is too serious to ignore. All right, Hanberger. And don't worry, I'll be silent as a snake. I can't tell if I'm more unsettled by Ziggy's transformation or the thought that someone in the brigade is at fault. Hmm. Iceberg turnip pastry. Oh my god, that looks amazing. This is a bad idea. I'm so hungry. <laughs> Shit. Chefs, I require your undivided attention. I wish to keep this brief so that we may release our findings to the public. Due to your exemplary work, our scientists have determined mutated ingredients are not harmful when properly prepared. Hmm. I'd like to extend special recognition to the members of C-Squad. There were some in the committee who doubted our decision to reinstate you. You've gone above and beyond to prove you deserve your place among the other contestants. To that end, we've changed the rules for this year's proving tournament. Chefs won't be expelled until their fifth loss, but your previous record carries over. Oh, well, I have four wins, so. With that, our tournament begins anew. Oh, the tournament's Save back! Brigade. Oh shit! Okay. Hog, I guess. I hope trusting Ziggy was the right decision. Also good to know, every time I die, it looks like a minute of time. Or maybe 45 seconds. Not fully sure. Surely he wouldn't break into a brigade lab without good reason. Come again? <gasps> Thrash! <laughs> you know, for a guard, you're not very alert. <laughs> ha ha. What are you doing out this late? Oh no, you first. What's this about breaking into a lab? If I tell the truth, will Thrash try to stop him? Will he tell Razzle? Come on, Blue. You know you can trust me. <sighs> it's Ziggy. He thinks the mutation was started by one of the Brigade's alchemists. He's breaking in to find out for sure. I told him to come find us once he has the evidence. Kieran's not gonna like this. Yep. And you? Ziggy's a weird guy. 
I don't know if I trust him. I know what you mean, but when he talked about the outbreak, I believe him when he says he wants to fix it. Then, that's all I need to hear. I've got to get back to my post. Good night, Blue Jay. Night, Thrash. <laughs> I love these two, they're so adorable. Okay, a few days pass. Is Mina Han still staying here? Huh? That sounds like Instructor Razzle. But she's not supposed to visit until my final match. Oh no. Did she catch Ziggy? Oh no. Oh no. <gasps> huh. I've some visit that I still haven't written. I have to do it tonight. No excuses. Oh. Chip tree. Instructor Razzle. It's good to see you. Just breathe. <laughs> good morning, cadet. I have a few questions to ask you about an incident that occurred last night. Oh, no. An incident? Of course. How can I help? A citizen reported seeing a shadowy figure sneaking into the research lab last night. Oh, fuck. Did you see anything suspicious at your post last night? Play it cool, Mina. No, Thrash came to see me for a few minutes, but we weren't near the lab. I see. I've already spoken with him as well. That just leaves one other item. <gasps> oh, ooh, smoothie! What kind of smoothie? Hope the meds are helping, Geek. Welcome back. Oh no. What if she asks about Ziggy? Congratulations on your reinstatement. Woo! Whew. Thank you, Instructor. I'm really happy to be <laughs> back. And we are glad to have you, Cadet. Your expulsion was an unfortunate circumstance. I was pleased to see your name on the returning roster. That means so much to me. I don't know what to say. Except that I wish I could tell you everything. Just keep your focus on the tournament. Any distractions at this point could cost you everything. There won't be another opportunity to re-enlist this year. I know. And I promise to do my best. I don't doubt it. Very well. I must continue the investigation. Good day to you, Mina. Good day to you, sir. I was so close. Ziggy, this better than good kind day. Of joke. Hey, buddy. Hello. I only have one more wing to go, and then it'll be time to face the final three. Eek! I just get goosebumps from hearing you say that. Good luck, Leonid. Thank you. I'm a lot more nervous about it than I expected to be, but I guess that's a good thing. I'd rather go into it with my senses sharp than the lackadaisical about it. You're going to be great. You're practically a brigadier already. Thanks, Mina. I'm glad you're back. Me too. Oh, so sweet. Oh, may I be of service? I trust you're having a lovely stay. Of course. Thanks again for keeping me in the same room as before. Not to worry. Just do me one kindness. Make sure to tell everyone about the charming regal Warren and sure. Well, looky here. Wait, what, what was the voice I, I did for him? <laughs> well, looky here. You clan your boy, Buck. Fuck, I'm struggling to remember. You clan your way back just when I thought I found some peace and quiet once and for all. It's a a long story, and I don't care to hear it. <laughs> but since you've got a second chance, you better walk twice as hard, you hear? Don't worry. <laughs> I, I keep rolling my arms when I switch to Mina. I'm not going to waste this opportunity. It's called Purple Haze. It has coconut milk. Akai? Mixed berries and banana. What is it? Akai? Wait, what kick? All I can feel like can st Oh, all I, f all I can feel like on stomach right now? Like, something that you can eat and, and not feel too bad about it? Gotcha. <gasps> Puzzle time! Slime tank gun. What's it say about the bone marrow? It could be a good addition, but I'm thinking we might want to check out horn shavings. Brilliant! Brilliant! What are you two up to today? Oh, just trying to save the world with cooking and science. You know the deal. I finished my match for today, so I thought I'd help out here. 
We're working on an antiviral medicine for the mutated monsters. Can I help in any way? Absolutely! I am drowning in work! Oh. I still need to move forward with my ambrosia formula. The brigade is checking in on its progress in a few days. But is there like a fruit, a vegetable, something entirely unrelated? Like I don't I don't think I've seen it before. Or at least if I did, I don't remember what it is, Geek. Got it. I can help put more dishes together. This one will require a defter touch than usual. I've set up I've set you up with a special combo pan. Each each time you complete a merge, the dish's combo counter increases. When you've stirred the dish to perfection, the combo counter will energize parts of your dish. Stir low quality taste gems into those slots to upgrade them. Speed's not a problem for me. Oh. Oh, that's sick! It's a very... oh, okay. Another combo pan for you. You'll need to build up your combo fully before it runs out. Then use each combo spot to upgrade your flavors. Cut speed. Okay. Bog. Comes from a poultry native to Central and South America. Oh. How do those horn shavings do? I felt like I've heard the name before, and I had a feeling it would be from like South America somewhere, probably, but I could not remember for the life of me what it was. Quite. Unpleasant. Hmm. This is powdered horn. I think the texture caused a reaction. Anchovies! <laughs> right again, Kirin. Mina, we'll both be learning from this young lady in no time at all. <laughs> That's Kirin for you. I've never seen anyone work harder. I love the art in this. So, so good. So good. I embalm them with a technique I learned from my father. It's exquisite. They don't look a day decayed. Perfectly frozen in time. Hey there, Mina Flan. <laughs> you don't notice at first glance, but this place is a top-notch museum of monster history. This girl isn't interested in stories. She's here for another hunting job, aren't you? Uh. Uh, uh, well, I am, but I'd love to hear about your hunts, too. But you hope it's helping, Geek. No, about this lapisode scale here. Not a chip or scratch on it, see? Mm hmm. Better hurry. <laughs> Shit. No, there's gonna be. No! Yes, we try. Damn! That was Let's rough. Oh, thank God, yes. <laughs> of Thorn's trophies? Oh! I need to Google this. I'm curious now. Time palm. Oh, they look kind of like, uh, kind of like blueberries, no? Oh. 
Interesting. Wait, what is this? Wait, what did did they just Joker two seems to be confirmed? Huh. Fully I do. Huh. Okay, I just saw that randomly in Twitter. Interesting. A little, just a bit bigger. Oh. No, they're too far out of my reach. Their energy is gone, far away from this realm. Such is the fate of monsters. Huh, I wonder what they'd say. I'm back, baby. I'm officially back. Proving tournament, you hear me? I am back! Oh, I could just kiss the road, but I'm not going to because it's filthy. You seem to be in high spirits, Ward. Hm, you know it. I've been given a second chance, baby. This orc is gonna grab on and never let go. See, squad chefs are coming back for you, Brigade. Yes, look out, world! Hmm, I'm gonna get you, Mina. What was that? Nothing, honey. There's some dirt in your jacket. <laughs> wow. Oh, the restaurant's back! Hey, Pontita. Your friend sure ate a lot. Maybe you should try an eating contest. That's Simon. <laughs> <laughs> Ready to get back to work? The bird. I'm all in. Glad to hear it. I need all the help I can get. <gasps> French. Hiya. Good to see you. Whoop. Someone just spilled their water. Gotta go. Perfect timing. The rush is in. Let's get to it. Okay. Uh. Earth, and water, and some more. Perfectly delicious. Earth. And there we go. Delicious. Earth and or water and fire, and I'm gonna need more fire. Nice. Delicious. Fire. And there is the fire. Oh, I'm so excited. I'm so excited. Oh, thank you, dearie. Oh, that looks great. Easy, easy. Delicious. Nice. Thanks. Very much appreciated. Thanks. Oh, this looks wonderful. Earth. Actually, like this. And then like this. I can't wait. Nice. Delicious. Bog. Thanks. Water and fire and water. There we go. Oh, nice. <laughs> hey, hey. Thirty. Nice. Ooh, that was way more intense than a duel. No kidding. My feet are killing me. <laughs> All in a day's work, recruits. You'll need more stamina than that to make it in the brigade. For now, you've done a great job. Catch your breath, then make way for my paying customers. Make way. Yes, ma'am. Candle gold soup. Uh, so we already spoke with them. <gasps> Any news? How are things? Hey, Mina, you're not too far from the final. Three are... Or from the final three, are you? That's gonna make you feel on fire. Three more to go. 
keep strengthening your arsenal of skills and cookware. You're gonna need to pull out all the stocks for the gauntlet. And train my best. Really enjoy the demo when you get the game. Ooh, oh, I thought you had gotten it. I guess I got confused. Yes, it's a fantastic game. I don't know. I imagine this still works. I haven't tried it. But there's a... Uh, there's like a daily challenge mode and some other stuff as well. We can look at it later. Good luck from us both. My brother may seem more excited than me, but I look forward to your success just as much. What's this? Curious. Wow, I've never seen so much whiskered before. What did you get? Ooh, a bunch of new books. Venom gland. Two poison glands. She might like this. Serve a dish containing 25 or more ingredients. Serve a dish that received a 5x combo. Okay. Uh, but yeah, I'm glad you're liking it, Geek. Charmed, I'm sure. Whoa, that's such an awesome machine you have. I've never seen anything like it. A walking oven. Nalkir would love this. Thank you, man. His name is T-Bot. <laughs> nice to meet you, T-Bot. And I'm Quetzal. Quetzal Luminaire. I haven't been in this side of Brigade in this side of Brigade Town since registration day. I found a place uptown, but the competition's getting a bit stale there. It's crazy how big this place is, especially compared to my village. I mean a Han. Han? Aren't you the girl that threw a butcher knife at someone's head because you got angry? Ha what? That's not what happened at all. Is your stomach really iron? I've never heard of a person with metal parts. Devot is all metal. Mithril. You're way more interesting than the chefs I've met so far. Would you like to have tea with me? Um, maybe another time? Uh, but yeah, it has a... It also has local multiplayer, so you can do, like, actual competitions against someone else. Uh, I'm not sure how that works on the Switch. Uh... But, uh... Yeah, it's it's a fantastic game. I wholeheartedly, fully recommend this game to anyone and everyone. It's amazing. How about a cook-off? Maybe you'll find the chefs in this part of town more challenging. Mm, okay, but I want you to tell me about your iron stomach later. Sh sure. So this removing the poison... So, th so this turns poison and bones into things that can be used for any combination. Do I think that's better than having the cutting board? I'm not so sure anymore, especially because it takes a while. And I do like using my slow cooker. I may go back to this. For now, at least. Also, I feel like I'd rather have sauce. I I don't ever use this. So I have three rainbow ingredients, two red sauces, some bone ingredients. That's pretty good. What what point does the demo get to, uh, geek? If you don't mind me asking, because I never tried the demo. Or I don't know if it's different from the game, maybe it's like a single battle or something. Oh <gasps> this is Conclusions, it is with greatest shame that I apologize for the tournament's interruption. Okay, this is like the second best outfit he has. I love that. I really like that shade of green and all the gems and stuff that looks so fucking cool. For the love of the brigade and the glory of Victuja, I vow never to let a blight disrupt our ceremonies again. It's with utmost pride that I announce the return of many fantastic contestants. 
Their tireless work was instrumental in uncovering the correct way to prepare blighted meat. They are Curse of your greatest adoration. Wait, have you been lurking, Cursey? How did you see the old messages? Or are you using like BTTV or something? Only up to a single battle, okay. Today, a phoenix rises from its ashes. The iron stomach is back and ready for battle. Just get here. It shows me the history. Oh, wow. Mina. Also, Quetzal is joined by a sentient marvel of culinary magic named Tibot. Yeah, BTTV. Otherwise, it wouldn't show you. Uh, but yeah, uh, we're back in the competition. Apparently, there's a blight that's affecting all of the monsters, and they're having poison in their system now. Um, we were recalled for emergency measures to help try and fight it, and that's why we were reinstated into the competition. She's our first contestant in the history of the tournament to use a team name. The Tea Totalers! <laughs> Listen. God damn it. Also, the, the we did two fights. One was a friendly duel in which we had, which was the last one in which we had to do the first combination thing, where we had to do. What do you mean that sauce at all? Fuck off! <laughs> We're trying to solve the problem, not. We had nothing to do with it happening. Uh there was a where we had to do exactly the same amount of level 3 earth and fire gems. So that was interesting. We had to redo that one, actually. Because uh, we lost the first time. And the previous tool we did, when we first got back here, we had to... do a fire... No, earth and fire dishes. No, water and fire dishes. And we did so well that we almost doubled the points of the other person. We absolutely kicked their ass. We were four points away from doubling their points. I was so happy with that. Oh no, the monsters are suddenly all blighted. How strange. You better let me in, let us in. Oh look, they're all cured. Listen, they're not cured yet. Fuck off. <laughs> How dare you. How you doing? How's the, how's the packing and stuff? Ready, T-Bot? Quetzal. Quetzal. An acolyte <gasps> of the source from which all elemental energy sprang. Sun cultist Sargon! Thank you, Chairman Khan. Oh, this is new. In my travels, I've sampled many cuisines. Do not think you can pass off poor cooking because I'm foreign. Eight or nine boxes? Oh my god. And how much do you think that is? Like, out of all of the boxes you'd probably have. Sun cultist cooking is full of fiery flavors. I'd like a departure from the norm that features earth and water as the primary ingredients. Oh shit! This explosive match will be mediated by the wisdom of Grand Matriarch Hasjil. Probably half. Wow, okay. That's pretty good on a single on a single night. To get like half of it done. Plus organizing throwing out cleaning stuff, yeah. Now that these hopefuls have restored balance in the face of a blight, I've no doubt they'll be more impressive than ever. Mostly because board games are big, yeah. Cooking is more than recipes and precision. Rely on your intuition to determine how Earth will harmonize with your theme ingredients. Okay. 100 hmm. years ago, some of our forebears were reluctant to consume monster flesh, fearing the effects of cursed meat. Chefs of the brigade searched far and wide for the most animal-like monsters to convince these holdouts. Among the first accepted by the populace was the succulent... Cragmore! Oh! <gasps> All these boys! Vive la brigade! Okay, okay, okay. So we need earth and earth and water. Water and water and water 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 and water and water 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 and water and water water and water and water and water and water and water and 
Query cap, okay. Okay, so... Okay, that's water. We don't need you. Oh god. Oh god. I need some more of these boys. A hydra! Oh god, that's right! Uh... I just want another one of these fucking boys! And to not die. Okay, whatever. Let's just start. Uh, you go in there. Let me dump this bone. Uh, we can also throw some... Earth? Sure. Um... Just water stuff. No. Okay, let's do that for now. What do you give me? Uh, a lot of fire. I don't need fire. Okay, these are very earthy boys. Oh, there we go. More of these. Okay, now I need one that's mostly earth. Actually, that can be the mostly earthy one, I guess. And now we can mix this, and some of this, and some of this. Uh. Wait, let me get rid of that. gonna make it two fire and two water or two earth and two water that's pretty good uh we're gonna need more earth in here sorry chat i this is so difficult to keep track of <laughs> and speak to chat at the same time oh okay so these are good parts good 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 Oh okay. god, fuck off. Oh my god, this fucking crap. I'll fucking kill you. I'm guessing these are watery boys. Some of this, some of this. Actually, let me put this here. Let me put that out. Let me put these two out. Do that, and then we can focus on this. Cool. 
shit. I keep messing that up. Um, need to get more mirth, mirthy flavors. Okay, neither of these is particularly earthy. Uh, oh, that's perfect. The other boss on this area, I guess. Or the boss of this area, rather. Uh, yeah, this is pretty much only fire shit. Uh, that's a bunch of water. Okay, we have fucked in mushrooms. We can we can work with this. Uh. Those. Uh oh. Better get rid of this. So this is the earthy one. You go in there, and you're the mixed one. Okay, we did it. <laughs> did you burn the pretty Thank fox? You for Listen. Your hard work, chefs. <laughs> Let's see what the judges have to say about your efforts. <laughs> that does not look succulent. Wait, what doesn't look succulent? What we made? What do you mean? It looks amazing. What a pretty Firefox. Why did you murder a pretty Firefox? Listen, I had to make sure that it didn't have any, like, earthy flavors on it. Maybe it was a little bit meaty. I don't know. Maybe it wasn't only fire. <laughs> Oh, the main ingredient Next. creature, yeah. <laughs> That's very true. Cheap chi horn matcha dorayaki. Served with quarry cap and slime sauce melange. Okay. The herbal notes of the earth are equally matched by the cooling mouthful mouthfeel from the water. That looks neat actually. I, should, I shouldn't have doubted your ability. The dish is one of the most fantastic I've tried. Outstanding. Quarry cap stir fry. Oh. With a side of Crackmore claw and Crackmore shell medley. Nice. 275. You've made all this traveling worthwhile. I have no idea if Tushin cuisine could be so delicious. Fuck yeah, let's go! Quite delicious! Brisky tail matcha linguini! Oh my god! Topped with quarry cap and fiery sauce medley! Okay, that looks amazing! These herbal earthy flavors are exactly as I requested. Some dishes are so light and airy that they lose their substance. You've proven that's no issue for you. Positively superb. Steamed Crackmore shell. Like, look at that! That does look pretty good. 
teamed up with Griffon Talon and Quarry Cap Medley. Careful, Gabe Gotten, my mother, your adorable little creature. What do you mean? I would never. The Earth. So good. Impressively done, considering my request was a tough one. You'll thank me when you're in the field. Nice. Fresh from her reinstatement. Yes! Iron stomach proves she's playing to win. We win again. <laughs> now. Minaha is victorious. I would never hurt Geek's feelings. Geek is too pure for this world. Almost a hundred points over. Damn it! So close. Okay, but wouldn't y'all try the one at the bottom? The one at the top, I can kind of see. I'm like, mm, I don't know, maybe. But the one at the bottom, I'm like, I would definitely eat that shit. Looks buttery, smooth, flavorful. It's amazing. <sighs> that was pretty fun. But now I could use a nap. They both look terrible. Oh my god. It was a hard fought battle, that's for sure. <sighs> the worst. This is actually my first loss. I'm so happy to finally meet someone tough. <sighs> is this is this secretly Battleship Brigade 2? Did I miss that a sequel came out and I got it for free? Is that why Carsey is is doing the Carsey thing again? <laughs> Here. I want you to have this, Nina. You're my best friend now. Aside from T-Bot, of course. Ooh, Quetzal Sapphire team. Plus four mana, what? Okay, we have five. So now we can cast three tornadoes in a row at the same time. If we use that, holy shit. That's the other cool thing about this game, because you can decide to fight people in different orders, and I don't think you get the chance to fight everyone in a single playthrough. So you can, like, figure out what you want to get. I feel like it's more important to have three tornadoes at once than to have them do a bit more damage. <laughs> Oh, Simon! Big day. I have largely been positive, positive about this game. Those two dishes just didn't look good. Many of the dishes have looked great. <laughs> you have no I idea. know. I'm giving you shit. You have Today made me wonder if I can really do this. Get into the brigade and stop the blight? Maybe it's too much. I have a feeling I may need to... I don't know. Because for those that weren't here, I don't know if Geek left at some point, I know Carsey wasn't here. But I'm thinking of, I will probably get to a stopping point that's pretty good, I think, for this game. And we can leave it until after that space. But I think we may start this space tonight, if I get to that point. And if not, I may get to it. Uh, I may start that space tomorrow. Especially so I don't have to read as much, because my voice is starting to act up, I can tell. Um, my throat is a little bit annoyed with me <laughs> from all the talking. I'm not used to streaming as many days in a row yet again. I'm glad there, there's as much uh, voice acting as there is, but there's still quite a bit of reading in between the bunch of voice acting as well. A trinado? Oh my god. I wish for you? Tilith was here to boo you. Look, I whittled this from some spare kindling in my room. I thought you deserved a good luck charm between tournament battles and secret meetings. Simon's bear carving? <gasps> what the fuck? A bear carving Simon made for you. He tries to be smooth about it, but this took him hours. Three such slots? That's two more! It's beautiful. That's amazing. Thanks. Honestly, this is perfect timing. It's a reminder my friends are with me. That makes this next part awkward. But I gotta go. Flower duty calls. Carsey, I appreciate the pun. Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> perfect timing once again. Oh, and Mina? Yeah? Don't forget to win. <laughs> you got it. 
Hell yeah. I am equipping the shit right off clock now. Give it to me. Give me. Give me, give me more. Do I have to ride or... Nope. Oh, I can jump on the bed. I didn't realize that. I'm so sleepy, but I made a promise to write and I'm gonna follow through this time. Dear Ma, Pa, and Kiki. This is harder than I thought. <laughs> Dear Ma, Pa, and Kiki. I'm Mina, okay. Come quick, there's Bye, news. Mina. <laughs> Ooh. Uh, what? I really need to remember to lock that door. Let's rest and let's go. All right. You're reminding me of my mom. Where are we going? To Belkior's. Ooh. Ah, now that my two best assistants are here, I can commence with the announcement. Did you figure out a vaccine for the monster virus? I wish, but that one is going to take a bit more time. No, it's... You finished the Ambrosia Project? My word! Can't you give an old scientist his moment? <laughs> oh, sorry. Well, don't keep her in suspense any longer. With your help? Yes, you guessed it. <gasps> We've completed Ambrosia. Yes! Is that why the fucking thing on the left is spewing rainbows? <laughs> An adorable travel size for now until I can get it cleared by the brigade. Whoa! Congratulations, Belkior! Can we give it a taste? My dear, you needn't even ask. I've prepared a meal for all of us to share. I don't appreciate these mosquitoes biting my ankles. Oh no! One dish has no ambrosia, and the other does. I'm so excited. So, how is it supposed to work again? By itself, it doesn't taste like anything at all. But each spray on a dish heightens the existing flavors. <gasps> Stanley! How you doing? Oh my god, what's that face? <laughs> Think of how salt accentuates sweetness, but this works across multiple flavor profiles at once. Bon appetit. First, the base dish. This is good, Belchior. Brace yourselves. Now for the modified dish. Is that haggis with face? <laughs> what? Haggis? What is a haggis? No, it's a bean! It's a giant bean! Oh wow, it really works! I was curious about whether all the heightened flavors would clash, but it makes them clearer. Hmm, Haggis, what? Granted, you must still start with a good base. This is not a shortcut. If you start with a terrible dish, it will just accentuate the bad tastes threefold as well. Amazing! Here, I want you each to have samples. When I can reproduce these results, I can give you more. Thank you, Belchior. Yeah, this is really cool. Thank you. Pile of Ambrosia plus two promote sauces. Yes! What exactly has been going on in here? Pardon? My associates and I are just celebrating a culinary breakthrough. This guy again. <laughs> Mina Han of the Windy Village. I challenge you to a duel. What? Excuse me, but we're in the middle of something right now. Could you try again another time? No, I will not be slighted one more time. <laughs> I'm going to have to ask you to leave. No one talks to my students that way. Fuck off, Pierce Baby. When you cut me in line, you set off a fuse, and your time is up, Missy. Oh my god, more like Pierce Baby. As soon as I got to the registration table, <laughs> a bird flew by and dropped a gross gift right on my luscious locks. Didn't you hear that's good luck? I got some on my cloak when I first came into town. If you hadn't cut, I'd have been done registering and free of bird droppings. Then I needed to get a place to stay. And who do you think took the very last room at the Regal Warren? A room that would have been mine if it weren't for you. I slept in a smelly old tavern filled with drunkards that night. I had to share a mattress. Oh my god, sharing a mattress? Never. Yikes. The next day, I headed to the practice kitchens and all the stations were taken but one. As I was walking calmly to the sign-in booth, 
You and your friends rushed past me and took the last spot. Hmm. I suppose we were rushing because we wanted to make sure we had time before the opening ceremony. I was so unfamiliar with the arenas later that I lost my first match. Oh my god, stop being such a fucking piss, baby. Holy shit. Is this fellow serious? <laughs> yes. Yes, he is. I'm not leaving here until you accept my challenge. You don't have to listen to someone so entitled, Mina. Of course I accept your challenge. Why didn't you just ask me sooner? Well, young man, you best be prepared. Oh, I'm ready. Iron Stomach, you've met your match. I bet you were gonna triple his points. Also, I'm changing this for the Ambrosia. This is gonna be so strong, having all of these. Let's cook his ears. Haggis is a savory pudding containing sheep's pluck, minced with onion, oatmeal, soot, spices, and salt, mixed with sock and cooked while well, traditionally encased in the animal's stomach, though now an artificial casing is often used instead. What? I need to look this up. Haggis. Whenever you said haggis, I just thought of... Hmm... Of diapers. What the fuck? National dish of Scotland. I feel like these pictures are too, um... What do you call it? Uh, like they don't make it look too good. <laughs> I don't know. The shape is just something weird about it. <laughs> but I would try it, I guess. Today's challenge is the culmination of a highly contentious rivalry between two up-and-coming talents. Appealing. Uh, appetizing, yes. Just not make it look super appetizing. <gasps> oh, this suit again. I love it. All the shinies. Both contestants have traveled far and fought hard for their place in this tournament. But only one may continue. Who will prevail? I appreciate Today's geek. challenger should count himself warped. The iron stomach's blades are at the ready. Hell yeah. Mina! A brash new challenger who has a bone to pick with the notorious iron stomach. I give you wise, the righteous fury. You won't last another day here. Huh. Wise. Not much <gasps> is known about this judge, except that he appears to help those. Oh my god. The people of Victusia raise their glasses to Kevin the Generous. Is this Robin Hood? Sup. Sup. I'm here to try a dish with lots of fire and earth. And earth. <laughs> Wait, what happens to Stanley? Is it wife? Proud to present the fierce and noble warrior, Vivian the Vagrant. I mean, Vivian is waifu. Oh my god, my voice is going. Thank you, Chairman. <clears throat> I look forward to the battle between these two strong chefs. Strength is a duality. Warriors combine mind and body to achieve victory. Knowing this, you must present me a dish worthy of a warrior. Equal parts water and fire. Carsey. The great ogre philosopher Skuras divined metaphysical truths from the stars in a far away... I'm sorry, but... You know what's gonna happen to your foxy in, in it. She rejected modern comforts to live encased in a realm of endless night. Not much is known about her, save that she favored a rather unusual carrier. We're gonna need fire for both. For what creature could withstand that brutal darkness except... <laughs> Scowl! Oh, the burps! Vive la Brigade! Vive la Brigade! 
I'm sorry, Carsey. <laughs> I'm so kind of sorry. Oh wait, this is a different map. Never mind. Interesting. I mean, these sauces sound too bad. There we go. I need to kill you, bub. Okay, okay, and we can pick that up later. You're lucky, Carsey. Count your lucky stars. Okay, so we can start with the fire and water one. Um, gonna need more fire and water. I don't have any fire. Shit! Did everything I grab? Was it all shit? Where do I get fire in this fucking place? Tomatoes? No, this. Hmm. Why do I keep fucking that up? Okay, whatever. Uh, I need more fire! Where the fuck do I get fire? Only can find it from tomatoes! I mean, this has some fire at least. Okay, that has fire and water. Shit! Come in! Okay, this has fire and water. Okay, 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 okay! This, this can work. Oh shit, I didn't put this here. Um... I bet you guilted the other chefs in the losing with your wide-eyed farm girl shtick. Pathetic. Not as wide as your eyes are going to be when the judges taste my dish. Okay, come on. Yes, level that up. So 
this way we're gonna get... Okay, that's pretty good. Right? Yeah, this is fire and water, so this one is gonna be fire and earth. Awesome. Let's put this here. here and don't worry chat I have a plan awesome. so that's already the water an earth one so we're just gonna do this and make that that and we just need some more fire for this from like one of these or something. And now we can put this here. I'll put this here and then we're gonna get four fire and four Thing. And this is, has three fire and three water. And we're just gonna add. a bit more water and a bit more fire. So this is water and fire. Let's get cooking. Goes here. And this one goes here. Okay, it's pretty good. The fox had smarted you, that's how I'm Thank gonna choose to look at this. Uh-huh. Let's see what the judges have to say about your efforts. Listen to me. That fox has its days counted. So I kind of made the same dish for both of them, apparently. Righteous. <laughs> Windfruit Fraser served with watery sauce and Armorock liver assortment. I guess because I didn't use much of the... I used some of the turtle stuff, actually. I'm kind of surprised that... Because one had mostly tomatoes and the other one had a bunch of turtle stuff. I'm surprised that somehow we got the same dish. Delish. Delish. Scowl feet dim sum. <gasps> With Winford and Armorock liver melange. Nice, the fitty. It's good. Excellent. Oh my god, okay, I have to send this to Teal Beef. I know she wanted to see some crabs. Okay, sorry. <laughs> oh my god, this is fucking packed. Oh, it's an insult to offer a dish that's missing an essential ingredient. The scowl and the meal are one and the same. <gasps> Oh shit, he fucked up. Also, she wanted water and fire, and there's... Oh no, the proportions are fine. 
You've captured the spirit of strength, fire and oh we win! Fire and water coming together to make an even greater element. That looks fucking amazing though. I am proud to receive this dish, like my blade, it's a, it is a true masterwork. Impressive. With nochi fruit and burskit meat assortment. Yeah, like all of the included stuff is different, so I'm surprised. You honor me with this meal. I have never tasted like it before. Oh, <gasps> we won by over a hundred points. Get fucking wrecked, nerd! Another stunning victory for the Iron Stomach. Woo! Minaha wins. <laughs> Get wrecked, nerd! Well, madam. I've lost fair and square. Get fucked, piss baby. Weiss, it was a good match. I hope you know I never meant to hurt anyone. <laughs> I was just impatient. <laughs> Maybe you can start wearing a hat in case of bird danger from above. <sighs> That's the least of my problems now. I guess I'll have to try again next year. <gasps> Do you mean this was your last strike? So <laughs> humble listen here! This fucking asshole has been a pain in my ass I have for like two wins. days. I waited to challenge you as my last victory to make it into the finals. Wow. But the thing is, I also had four losses. Everything was on the line for this battle. You may be knocked out, but you're not knocked down. You're a great chef, Weiss. And you better try out again. Okay, Mina is a bigger person than I. I would have been like, haha, fucking get wrecked, nerd. Perhaps I will. As much as I hate to admit it, you gave me the drive to make it this far. For that, I'm grateful. Here, so you'll never forget me. Uh... What? Does he want me to pull his finger? Is he E.T.? What? Um... Dude, that's weird. Don't just point at people. That's not a. That's not a sparkle finger. Hey. <laughs> I... Hmm. This is sus. I don't like it. Ooh. Also. Oh fuck my life. I cannot. I cannot with this guy. <laughs> what a fucking asshole! <laughs> when you're feeling die, when you're feeling down, vice can turn things around. Prevents knockout ones. See you around someday. I fucking hate it here. What an asshole! Thanks for coming. Uh, also, I just remembered, I may have um, some good news later. Well, I'm not streaming Thursday. I don't know if I'll... S I guess it depends. Like, if I take tomorrow off, I'll probably be back Friday. If I don't and end up doing that space, I may be back... Saturday. Either of those days, I'll probably have some pretty good news, I think. I want to be absolutely sure first. I'm waiting for confirmation, but may have some pretty good news on the way. It was a favor to Mina. Now, let's see this evidence. <laughs> to the point as usual. I agree, though. What did you find? This. Hidden in the desk of one Grandmaster Rixel. <gasps> Him. Their plans to extract samples from the Dark Realm. Whoa! Samples for what? I'm not sure. Most of these notes are scribbles. Turn the page. He injected monster cells with the samples he found there. What? Good news? Oh, that's exciting. Yeah. And that isn't all. His drawings are identical to the mutated cells I've been studying. <gasps> so this man, Rixel, 
did start the outbreak. See, get fought, Carson. It wasn't me. I don't think the How dare you? Sign off on like that. <laughs> He's got to be hiding it from them. Ziggy, you were right. Don't look so surprised. We need to tell Razzle. No. Razzle, Dazzle. Kieran? I'm sorry, but we can't. You remember how she handled your expulsion. We don't know how many brigadiers are involved in this. Her reverence for the rules could put Rixel's findings in untrustworthy hands. Though I detest the methodology by which we acquired this information, we can't ignore it now. Right on, Diamonds. <laughs> Kieran's right, but Razzle's already investigating the break-in. If we're going to solve this ourselves, we have to be careful. We should go about our normal lives and finish up the tournament. Maybe let this rest for a few days. But won't that give the mutation more time to spread? The Brigade's got the outbreak under control for now, but they need us to put an end to it. We aren't much good to Victuja if we're under investigation. Uh, give me one sec. Oh, my controller disconnected anyways. Uh, someone's calling me. <laughs> Oops, sorry for the lack of music. That's from the controller disconnecting and kicking me out of the game. Uh, but I'm back and I have my Dinden now. So we may go into a break after this, maybe? Then it's settled. We'll go about our normal lives until we're in the brigade. A brigadier's life isn't really for me, but I'll keep myself busy. Okay, good luck, everyone. You too, Blue Jay. No. <sighs> it feels weird to be the one to actually knock a chef out of the tournament. And don't even get me started with Rexel. I should write about it, I guess. Let's see. Still no cure for the monster epidemic, but Belkior and Kieran are working non-stop. I miss you, and I hope you're all safe. Aww. Um, hmm. Oh, that's right, we have some new shit. Oh. Hmm. I do feel like this 2 HP, I, I really need to upgrade it somehow. Okay, let's go into a short break so I can have my foods. Also, I remember someone mentioned something about my food break today. What was it? Or am I tripping? Oh, nice! Asked me to look at something on Twitter. <laughs> God damn it, that nerd. I don't hurt a bit, but freaking nerd. Uh, okay, let me get some music again. Oh, me! I'm excited for your potential good news, Cotton. That's great. Wait, what? <laughs> oh, I didn't see this because apparently, I guess there's no mods or well, I wouldn't see it on uh, mobile anyways. Uh. Me, I'm excited for your potential good news, Cotton. That's great, Cotton. Get fucked, Garcy. <laughs> That's, uh... Wait! When did I say that, though? Did I? Or at least after I mentioned that? <laughs> I don't feel like I did. <laughs> I 
Anyways, uh, I'll go have some numps and I'll be back shortly. You said it literally immediately after reading my message saying, oh, exciting. Wait, did I? No way. No way. I, I probably meant it about something about the game. There's no way. I don't know. <laughs> I... I don't see that happening. Gonna have to clip it. It was about the game, yes. Wow, well, <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> of course it was about the game. It was just really great timing. <laughs> oh my god. You... You... I hate you. <laughs> okay, I'm gonna go eat. Fuck off all of y'all, the worst. That was an accident. <laughs> Thank you. 
Hello? Okay. <laughs> We're back. <laughs> that, uh, the music was a bit more uh, epic than this, but you know what? You both look <gasps> really cool in your uniforms. Holy shit! Mine feels a little tight. I might have to lose a few pounds. <laughs> oh my god. It feels strange to be wearing them before the closing ceremony. People have already asked us for help like we're staff. Well, we really are in the brigade. They just haven't thrown us a party yet. Yay! I know we're supposed to be laying low, but have you guys discovered anything else? <laughs> What's up, Studley? <laughs> Welcome back. Not quite, but I did do some experiments after Belchior went to sleep last night. What? <clears throat> and here I always think of you as such a rule follower. Ooh. A little time with the Blue Jays really corrupted you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, I'm just passionate. Quite so. Can I do anything to help? Soon. I'll call you all together as quickly as possible. For now, the plan remains the same. Which means you've got a match against the final three to win. It's weird to say with everything else going on, but I'm really nervous about my match. I don't find it odd at all. I felt the same way before mine. <gasps> Glad Geek! Hell yeah! Hey, don't sweat it. You're gonna be perfect. Exactly. You'll be joining us tomorrow, and hopefully by then I'll have more definitive data. Alright, I'll put all my energy into my match prep then. Then it's the final three who should be nervous. We better head out. It's nearly time to report for our first official assignments. Bye! Heck yeah! Okay. Looks like there's one more round then. Oh! You got a letter today, Mom. Thank you. Wait, did you find your glasses? No, these are brand spanking new. Without them, I couldn't make at all. My measurements were so candy wampus, my famous Winfred cookies turned to soup. But now that my sight's back, I made you batch. You're one of my favorite customers, after all. Well, really? Thank you! I can't wait to try them! Also, I'm sorry for <laughs> this horrendous accent. <gasps> Dead of candy! The innkeeper apologized with this. Let's hope he made these after buying the new glasses. Successful combos get two extra combo fuses. <gasps> what? Okay, that's pretty good. Oh, and it goes in here. Oh my god. Um. Oh, we get access. What a treat. Oh my goodness. Stop. Too sweet. <gasps> What's this? Mitz! Hey! Thank you for the raid! <laughs> How's it going? <clears throat> the most unlikely is the raids. Hell yeah! Hey Mats! Hey Scozy! How are you- Or Scoys! Sorry. Is that how you pronounce it? Uh, how y'all doing? Amber Ant, how you doing? Let me- Give me a quick shout out. Sorry, I have- I don't think we have mods here today, so I'm gonna take a little break to do this real quick. Luck, luck be a landlord. What is that? Oh no, oh no, the game broke again. Shit, <laughs> I hate alt tabbing. I should have done it on the phone. The reliction of duty. Oh, wait. Oh my god. Yeah, the game worked. Give me a sec. <laughs> Sorry. There. We stopped it. <laughs> I hate this. Sorry, the game just acts up when uh, <laughs> when all tabbing. It's fine. It'll take a second. It saved right where we left off, pretty sure. So, it'll be fine. Uh, but yeah, how's the, what kind of game is that? How are you liking it? And thank you for the raid. You want to follow me? It's... A streamer of many different things, but a lot of GeoGuessr as well. Although I don't know if you're still in the in the kickoff for that or if you've changed too much lately. The game is you playing a slot machine. Your landlord, landlord had his style in Jesus Christ, I can't read. Installed in your apartment building to be able to pay the rent. Wait, what? You have to gamble to get rent? <laughs> What? It's basically a deck builder. Okay. 
That's uh that sure is interesting. <laughs> huh. Neat. Glad you're liking it. Uh Yes, you choose stuff to add to the slot machine that gives different buffs and stuff. Huh. That's interesting. Uh, as for me, I've gotten we stream whatever day I decide to stream. <laughs> Usually I announce it on Discord. Uh, at 7 p.m. Eastern Time, US. Uh, we have been streaming a lot of scary things lately. We did Deadlight, we did Prey. We're doing Dead Space 2 next, probably starting tomorrow, uh, if not, maybe later tonight, if we reach a good stopping point in this. Uh, now taking a small break with this, which is like an anime cooking somewhat Monster Hunter-ish game, uh, <laughs> to break the, the scary tension for a little bit. Um, but yeah, glad to see you all here, thank you for the raid again. It's been great to sink a bunch of time into without thinking a whole lot. Yeah, that's very nice. Curious. What's the glittering on the windowsill? <gasps> a coin. Oh, nice. It's totally wood. <laughs> Palm? Palm? Where did Parmesan go? Pecorino, where's your brother? Also, this is... um. This man... I saw Andy was guessing the Geos earlier. I... I I think I saw you were there too. How did he get on? He he got one place within like two meters, I think, which was kind of impressive. Like the first run was very good, and then he did a second run, and it went pretty disastrous. <laughs> I can't remember. I don't remember a lot of. A lot, a lot. Uh, but I think on the second one, like he got something where it had like CD Transit, which is like the the bus one of the bus line thingies we have here in Connecticut. Uh, and he was like, "Oh, that's Connecticut!" And then he started looking all around the U.S. And apparently, he didn't know or notice that it was a state, even though I've mentioned this to him before. And I was like, "Andy, Andy, please." Uh, <laughs> So he just started looking, thinking it was a city. <laughs> Even though I told him, one, that I live in Connecticut, two, that I'm in the middle of nowhere. <laughs> so he was like, it's maybe some big city somewhere. Uh, and spent a kind of honestly embarrassingly long amount of time before he finally gave up and looked at chat and was like, where the fuck is this? Oh, oh, it's just, okay. Okay. <laughs> finally found it. Uh... Also found like a. He did one particular thing without looking. He found Duluth, and he thought it was Canada. And then he kept searching whatever, and then realized that it was Minnesota. But then forgot, I guess, that it was Duluth, and he tried to put the thing in Minneapolis. <laughs> like, he did very well at times. Some of the times it was not great. Should have done it in CDs near Rhode Island just to mess with them. <laughs> oh my god. Uh, but yeah, it, it went. Uh, you were there for the loot nice. It was. Uh, it was something else. Also, this man is a professor trying to find the cure for a blight that showed up. That's part of the plot, and he has a bunch of cats all named after cheeses. And I love them. Belkir is the best. Get a little burned out with it. Ah, oh, that makes sense. It's totally valid. Glad you're finding other things to play and enjoying. How goes it, Belkir? I'm stumped. I thought I was on to something, but I'm going to need to do more digging. But yeah, again, thank you for the raid. And if you need to go rest or have some food or whatever, please feel free to do so. Don't feel Got like you need to stick moment. around. That's why I'm here. Excellent. Give me a hand with these tricky ingredients. 
How and what is this game? Yes. Uh, <laughs> how? <laughs> how is this game? This game is 10 out of 10. I absolutely fucking love it. It's amazing. It's one of my favorite in the games. I played it once many, many years ago. Uh, maybe in like 2017, I want to say. 2018, maybe? Uh, it did come out in 2017, so it was probably 2018, actually. Uh, and I didn't remember a lot. What is this game? So this game is about this character on the left, Mina, who is basically a cook in this universe where there used to be... Like, there's a bunch of monsters everywhere. Fighting cooking puzzles, yes. Uh, there's a bunch of monsters everywhere, and there's this giant, like, brigade of professional super chefs that can fight the monsters and cook with the things they get from the monsters. Uh, and they're the only ones trained enough to deal with all that shit. And we are basically going into a tournament that decides who's gonna become the new batch of uh, Battleship Brigade members. Uh, brigadiers. And the way the game works is we keep going into this fight, these competitions where we have to go out into a field. There's a bunch of different monsters going around. There's natural like berries and shit as well and you have to find ingredients bring them back to a station and you have to cook it at the a meal for judges based on if they want something that's more earthy more watery more spicy stuff like that and we're gonna see an example of the cooking in a little bit here we go actually it's it's not exactly match three but mostly <laughs> You'll see. Because uh, basically, like this is a bit regular pan that mixes things every three components. But uh, you can get different pans and other things that do other stuff. Wait, what? What am I missing? Oh. Here. Aha. Uh -huh. Okay. I forgot about that. <laughs> so you keep mixing everything. It gives gives you points. Oh my god! And. It just keeps getting increasingly more complicated. The story is pretty good. The characters are charming. Um. There we go. Nice. Uh, it's pretty good. I love this puzzle approach for cooking. If real cooking was like this, I think I'd do it a whole lot more. <laughs> yeah. So you basically find different animals and things that have different combinations of like maybe mostly fire with some water or whatever. And depending on what the judges want, you try to plan. Okay, they told me I, I need to start it off with this thing. It has to be based on this thing, this animal or whatever, this fruit, etc. Um, and then you kind of had to plan a little bit what you're gonna, what in, which ingredient you're gonna get, and then you have to go out and fight it. Splendid. Unfortunately, it's conjured more questions than it's solved. Don't tell me we're not any closer to finding the vaccine. My dear girl, progress is slow in the world of science. We're closer than we've ever been. And in between each duel, we have these, like, training things, like this last one and this next one, that give us some gold so we can buy upgrades and stuff. Tell me, girl, how old are you? And this one is going to show the actual combat. Uh, 21, ma'am. Then you must know. Our jackalope antler is not appropriate for anniversary gifts anymore. I can't keep up with the latest crazes everyone in the city flocks to from one year to the next. 
Whatever happened to sharing dragon's blood wine atop battlefield ruin? I don't think I'm the best person to give advice on these things. Kieran has a fiance and she's so trendy. Maybe you can ask her. Hmm, perhaps I will. Carry on. There's a new assignment on the wall. Okay. Also, all the most of the dishes look so good. Okay, here we go. So we have stuff like that. We have throwing daggers. Oh god. We can throw tornadoes. There's a bunch of stuff. Oh, hand lap wizards. So we specifically have to kill these boys. In a certain time. Uh, if we want to get the gold. Come here, boy. Oh my god. No! Come in. Oh, there's no way. Shit! Hmm. So not a great game to play while hungry. I actually had dinner maybe five minutes before you raided and I was so hungry from playing this. <laughs> like it's not it's not even funny. <laughs> I was so hungry. That should be enough. Yeah. Okay, just need one more. Come on! There we go. <laughs> oh, how was the tackle well? Oh, okay. I was gonna mention about this. About what? A gift so rare, it's nearly legendary. A woe? Wow. What is it? That's none of your concern. Sorry, I asked. <laughs> Iceberg turnip pastry on Mugga. Okay, so... <laughs> yeah, that'll happen. I found that whenever I played Cook Serve Delicious. Oh, that one's another... This reminds me a lot of that game. I actually was thinking about it today. Oh, I just realized. Up here. Shiv, Leonid, Cesar, Siggy, Quetzal, we... Why? It shows us all of the the order of the shifts we did. I didn't realize that before. Because you can do fights in different... Like, you don't fight always the same person. Like, you have options, usually. Uh, so your playthrough can be different and get different rewards at different times, etc. etc. Uh, based on what you do. Um, but I just noticed that. That's pretty cool. But yes... I so yesterday my family went to do something and returned pretty late. Like they came back here almost at eleven ish. Like it was literally about to finish stream. And they brought decided to get some Taco Bell because my mother wanted a salad. I know, from Taco Bell. Salad. Surprise, they didn't have any. Um uh, so you know. We ended up getting it anyways. And I had only had food from Taco Bell once in my freaking life. And I'm pretty sure I got like a chalupa or something that one time. Because it was the only thing I recognized the name from like somewhere. <laughs> and I was like, I guess this looks okay. Um, so I had to stop and open up the menu. I just literally stopped playing the game. Open up the menu and be like, hey, chat. Taco Bell. What the fuck should I get? What's good? What do I avoid? Tell me all the things. So we ended up getting three Doritos Locos Tacos, which I put I put kind of a review on the Discord. Uh, to be honest, um, I put a couple pictures and the review. Which this disc? How dare you, Carsey, not see that? Wow, so rude. <laughs> I'm kidding. Uh, the Doritos tacos were fucking great. Mostly because I am a fiend for Doritos. They're so good. 
I love them. Uh, like the proportions of everything was very well done. Like it, it wasn't, it didn't have like amazing ingredients or anything. It was kind of like a basic taco, but pretty well done. And with the shell, it was fantastic. Because uh, Doritos, duh. <laughs> oh, I actually did see the page. I just didn't read. <laughs> I meant to go back and read it, and then forgot. <laughs> wow. <laughs> It's fine. Uh, I tried the... So was it soft potatoes? Spicy soft potato soft taco something? Whatever. Uh, pretty good. Would have liked it bigger. More. Like a bigger thing. More potatoes. More sauce. Uh, but considering it was one dollar, it was pretty fucking good. Uh, very good taste. The taters were, felt very nice. Uh, it was very good. I tried the burrito thing. It had like maybe three bites that were like particularly flavorful. <laughs> the rest was literally just beans. Uh, that thing was like beans up to the ass, literally. Uh, I don't know who would ever order that. If you do, I judge you because it's it literally just tasted like beans. 90% of the time. <laughs> I mean, if you love beans, I guess, like, Andy would love it. <laughs> I guess. Uh, but otherwise, mm, no. <laughs> I pass. Uh, I didn't even realize it had a sour cream until I had, like, two bites left. <laughs> Which, somehow, like, how do, you, uh, how do you hide the taste of sour cream? It's so strong. <laughs> I don't know, I... This was it was a trip, uh, and I also tried Baja Blast, which, after how so many years of people hyping it up, I tried it and I could not comprehend. I think it's good; it grew slightly on me, but in the end, it still kind of felt like drinking minty antifreeze. <laughs> it gave me that sensation. <laughs> It looks similar too, uh, <laughs> but uh, I don't know. All in all, it was pretty good. I liked it. Uh, I never had any interest in trying Taco Bell a lot. Um, I like the freezes better. Yeah, I heard. I think Ash mentioned the same. Uh, but I just wanted to try the like actual drink, I guess. Um, but, uh, yeah, all in all, I before this, I didn't want to eat Taco Bell, really. But I wouldn't mind getting it again. Maybe trying different things. Alright, I gotta head off. Being, being waking up, re being woken up, <laughs> at about 6 a.m. daily courtesy of a kidding, so I need to sleep. <gasps> Rest well, Matt. Thank you for the raid again. Take care. I appreciate you. Hello, best friend. I just saw the final three. They look really tough, but t -Bot and I aren't going to have any trouble. I've only been drawing... I've only seen drawings of them where they look like demigods. Isn't Lieutenant Dive super tall? She is, and she is the brightest golden hair I've ever seen. I hope I don't freeze up in the kitchen when I'm facing them. They're only pers they're only normal people with a lot of experience. Just remember that. We've got all the kitchenware you need. Just one more win, and I'll be facing the final three. Give me all your most powerful items. All right, Mina, go, go, Mina, go. Yes, congratulations. How about Robuchon's Radiant Whisk? Robuchon himself used this, you know? That'll be 100,000 gold. Uh, that's just a little over my budget. Back to the bargain bin. <laughs> I'm super sleepy. Gonna head to bed and watch on my phone, which probably means I'll be asleep in 10 minutes. So in case I pass out before I get the chance to say it later, good night. Oh, good luck with the rest of your food battles, God. Thank you, Carsey. Get some good rest, friend. I imagine you're fucking tired of shit after all of the preparing <laughs> for the for the move. <gasps> Here's some new stuff. Focus charm. 
Ah, that's fine. Crystallizer oven. Whoa! Its walls are coated with a magical glaze. It slowly clones taste gems? What is this? Slowly clones taste gems. Yes, much exhausting such dire. Huh. So say we have, like we've had in the past, something that gets to be... Like we have like three level three fire gems and two level two fire gems. Like it would just maybe clone the red the fire, so we would have four level threes and two level two level three waters. And then maybe clone something else. Oh. Huh. That's interesting. But I feel like what we have is working fine? Question mark. Huh. How's it going? Hey, about the other day, you mentioned the Brigadier's life wasn't for you. I did. Then why are you in the tournament in the first place? Now that is a great story. Put one for another time. Seriously? Dead serious. <laughs> no? Serious is a heart attack. <laughs> okay, okay, what about serious is the grave? <laughs> Honestly, your standards for warplay are way too high. You know what? I probably better. It's probably better the less I know. Oh my god. Good morrow. Lovely afternoon, isn't it? It's beautiful out. The brigade sure has its hands full. What with the tournament and the strange monsters? They did a really good job at minimizing the situation in very little time. Everyone is working so hard. Must be. The seed loves the proving tournament, but I like the rest of the year more, to be honest. There's time to stop and smell the roasts. <laughs> the roasts? Instead of the roses? I've never been busier in my entire life, but I love it. I can see the spark in your eye. Well now, don't let an old man keep you. Here's a gift for you on your way. Orchid Blossom? Oh! <gasps> Wow! A taste gem in vegetables and fruits is promoted when collected, so it randomly makes fruits and stuff better. Wow! Wow! I guess this is better than that. Yeah. Let's try this. Try a muffin. I've been practicing making my cheap risofle every day. The judges better stay on guard because it's the explosive baby. I want it recorded in brigade history and shared with the world. I'd love to see how you make it work. I need to do more banking. There are so many pastries I have no idea how to make. Or oh, baking, not banking. Fuck my life. Tired. Well, just call me if you ever want to foster your sweet tooth. After the tournament, of course. Can't have you stealing my recipes. Well, no, I'd never. Of course not, sweetie. Okay, let's go practice. I want to see which map we're going to. Yeah, this is fine. Okay, so we're back here. It would seem. What I want to practice is on a different map. I guess we could try again and see if it sends us to a different one. Hmm. Doesn't look like it. I don't see anything to change where it's gonna send us. Yep. Okay. Hopefully that means we go to this map next time. I best make use of your value still available. Soon you're going to be the brigades. I'll still stop by. Maybe to eat. But you'll be too busy to help here. Trust me. 
Just I may have mentioned it to you, but two of my sous chefs entered the tournament this year. Only one of them made it in the other day. It's hard to see best friends separated like that. But he's here and back at work instead of fretting about it. I think this whole thing has made him even more determined. Wow, he's taking it much better than I did. Guess I'll have to work even harder. Okay. Nice. Oh, thank you so much. Wait. There we go. Perfect. There. Thank you. There we go. Oh ho! All right. Nice. So good. Yes. Delicious. Nice. Thanks. Water, fire, water, fire. Nice. Oh, this smells delightful. Thank you. Oh, I didn't even realize that was gonna do that. Water, grass, and water. Water and water and water, 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 water. Nice. Uh, oh, there's no way to this in time. Eh. It was still very good. Hell yeah. 44, Maybe holy shit. With you, Mina. Thank you, Pontita. I'll do my best to make you proud. Got so much money. So we can fight him, or... Was he the only one left? I guess he might be. We might, we might have been siblings in the trenches of Sea Squad, but now it's the time to put our bonds aside and bear arms against each other. Uh, oh, okay. You mean a duel? Sure. Don't you underestimate me now. I may have a skin of a sweet baby, but I am a cooking machine. So we have four mana, some HP, such a... So if we get vegetables and fruits, they get... One of the things get upgraded automatically. We have Ambrosia to promote things. This gives us better combos. This has to come... Okay. Bring it on! Bring it on! Okay, after this, I'm hoping it, we will get to the story point I was thinking of, and maybe the perfect stop for now with the skim. And we'll also give time to, like, Tea Leaf and Geek if they want to play it too, to see the entire story, unless they don't mind, of course. <gasps> the Nazura orcs believe the weapon the chef chooses as their own becomes an extension of themselves. The two share a common desire, a goal. A collective consciousness, if you will. So too must a chef wield their ambition as a weapon. A blade that carves a path forward, but never at the expense of their fellow chefs. The chefs before you today embody that principle. They are the best the tournament has to offer, but must survive one last battle to reach the final three. The school. Like the tea rose that blooms from spring till fall, the iron stomach returns for another round. Hell you. Yeah. Mina. Mina. Before you stands an orc with fingers nimbler than the most dexterous elf. 
Grand Patissier Wart! Oh my god, Grand Patissier? I'm a baker, not a cream buff! Don't mistake me for a pushover! Wart! <gasps> On the far <gasps> left, Instructor Meriday! So she's gonna want I water. I look forward to thoroughly scrutinizing each dish's profile and composition. Ensure your work is of the highest standard. I'd rather like to see how the contestants combine <clears throat> the brightness of water with the density of lupir meat. Ooh. In the middle, Chief Engineer of the Seon Institute, Lian! I'm not here to make friends or stroke egos. Bring me something impressive or go home in shame. <laughs> My main concern is your ability to effectively take down your quarry. For that reason, I've decided to request fire and earth to see how you fare against multiple types of beasts. On the end, Grand Matriarch has Jill. Yeah. A victory today represents a chance to prove yourself in the final gauntlet. I will not administer my praise easily. Mm -hmm. beer is an important ceremonial meal to my people. Traditional preparation features plenty of herbal, earthy seasonings. I'd like an entree that captures that essence. Where's the pier? There's an old tale about a goblin who lost her way in the cabin. So we have to make three different dishes. So we're gonna need to do one sort of quick if we can. And turn it in ahead of time. For days, she wandered its many twists and turns, searching for an exit. Just as she was starving and about to abandon hope, she saw a light. Suddenly ecstatic, the girl ran toward its warm glow, only to run into the jaws of the dreaded Lupir. Oh! Garcy, I hope you're asleep. <laughs> Vive la Brigade! We're gonna have to kill more than one for this. No! <laughs> yes, I told you it's days would come. <laughs> Did wreck any pony? Oh shit. Got fucking blasted. Damn it. Yeah. Okay, so we need something that has water first. Sure, let's do this. Gonna cut this out. Uh, we're gonna throw some of these. Huh. Um. Something with like one little fire thingy. Oh, we can do this, sure. Okay, so this way. We need fire and grass for one of them. Okay, let's just put this here and have it slowly upgrade and shit. The other one mainly wants water. Hmm. Unsure. Let's see. Let's let's just go find more stuff. <laughs> Oh, 
Wait, what? They got stuck in there! God damn it. Here's another boy. Sorry, not sorry, boy. But it's a Bree! I hate it here. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh god. That's just gonna damage it, and we're gonna leave and dump some ingredients. So, we need this to be more earthy and fiery. Okay, this way we're gonna have four fires in one of these. It's gonna be gone. There we go. This one is gonna need water. We don't have a lot of water. Let's put this in here. Now the question is, which one do we want to... So this is... should be mostly water. Um... sure. Okay, so th when this is done, it's gonna be... Earth and Fire and Equal Measure, okay. This is... it has to be the water one. Okay, this one goes for him. This is gonna come in here. It has to be mostly water. Oop. So let me actually get rid of this one. And do that. And now we need something that's earthy. Agent, hi! Is that an agent they see? A hacking cutie? How you doing, my friend? I have... I need more meat from this boy. Sorry. I need to do another moida. Look away, chair. I don't choose the moida. The moida chooses me. Oh, shit! Also, sorry, Agent, this requires a lot of focus for me, so, uh... Oh, God! No, I cannot lose time! Fuck! <gasps> you 
fucking don't you dare. No, give me my shit. That shit's pretty good. Karma, get out of here. Okay, I need earthy shit. Uh, you get in there. I'm gonna throw a bunch of these. Start mixing that up. Okay, this we're gonna go there. Oh shit! Wait, can we add? Do I even have any more? Sorry, you got the shittier one. I didn't have time. <laughs> Let's go! Thank you for your hard work, chefs. Let's see what the judges have to say about your efforts. Oh my god. Okay, now we can... <laughs> I'm going to see your cage. How, how's, how's things going? How's... Uh... Dead salts and all that stuff. Hope work is okay too. Hope you're, you're chilling. Having a good time. <gasps> Waiting for you to cook me something good? Oh my god. I will show you. Karma. God, Stutley, get out of here. <laughs> oh my god, every dish looks so fucking good. Lovely. King Bean Closse. Served with Slime Core and Cragmore Claw Medley. You certainly adapted well. The water brings a freshness without adding unnecessary density. Well measured and executed, the ingredients blend together quite well. Moved on to learning Binding of Isaac. The game does so well at making it all look good. Nice. Yes, it does. It really do. The art style is so fantastic. The beer hot pot. Mm. With hydronic and lantern fruit assortment. Hey, we won! This, at least this judge. Hmm. Cheap G horn bretzel, garnish with lapi lapis art legs and slime eggs melange. I see you took care to seek monsters with lots of fire and earth gems. But it has poison, you'll have to try harder than that to get rid of me. Oh no! Fire Poor word. Lapeer steamed meatballs. Oh my god, we turned that fiery little boy into some meatballs. Spicy meatball, eh? quite literally. Served with candle gourd and learned in fruit melange. Just look at that shit! I said that you took care to seek monsters with. Yeah, yeah. You made quick work of those beasts. If it seems big Tushin battle chefs are as skilled as they say. Freaking Poggies. Positively superb. Barun Steak Rouladen. Served with lantern fruit and Hydra Long Melange. Oh, it has poison again! Earth is the perfect stabilizer. You capture it beautifully in this dish. Poison must be carefully extracted from blighted meats, not masked with other flavors. More meatballs! <laughs> but earthy meatballs this time. Your interpretation of the dish is my favorite so far. Plenty of earth, evenly sparked throughout, or spread. I respect the dish, and pleased with your work. Fuck yes! 
we also got 690 points. Incredible! The Iron Stomach wins her last qualifying match in a jaw-dropping sweep. Woo! Minaha wins. Woohoo! Let's go! Nice. Oh, I need to sit down. I can't breathe. It's all over. Worth no. It, it's only one match. The committee extended the strikeout count from three losses to five, remember? When the tournament started, I was one of the first to be eliminated! Oh shit! Now I'm at loss number four! I only have one chance left! Then pull yourself together and make it the best win streak the competition has ever seen! What? You got this! Impossible! No! Impossible my eyes! My ass! You're the grand petitier! You gonna do it, boy! actually lost a match yet. Huh. Wait, you? What are my biscuits, Mina? You're my inspiration from now on! Hell yeah! <laughs> Ward spatula! Let's get cooking, baby! Protects fragile test genes for one extra move! <gasps> Sick! That's actually pretty interesting. Hmm. Oh, well, they should go sleep. Dear Mimi, Alex has been helping around the restaurant a lot, and he's begun to play music out front sometimes. I was afraid Pa would get annoyed, but I think he actually likes him. <laughs> the restaurant is doing fine now that we handle the ingredients more carefully. Ma is resilient as ever, working day and night as usual. Oh no. Oh, I'm so close. Finals, here I come. Hell yeah. Helping people as part of the brigade is going to be amazing. Those uniforms look so cool. Oh, I wonder if I'll get brigade issue knives. <laughs> it feels good to take a break from thinking about the mutation. This is it. The big day. The final three. I just have to breathe. Take it one round at a time. I got this! Let's go! Hmm. Hey, Mimi. <gasps> hey, Kiki! Hey, Alex! Surprise! Your sister was determined to see you in your finals match. Do we make it in time? I can't believe it. This is so weird. Am I still asleep? Nope, you're not dreaming, girl. Sorry, I'm just shocked. I'm so happy to see you. You traveled all this way, but how did you know? <laughs> you? Yep, Simon started planning it basically since you left. <laughs> <laughs> Guilty as charged. Now, aren't you glad I told you to pack an extra pair of shoes? The pair I had could have made it all the way. We've packed too much as it is. Ma, Pa! You guys too? Hell you. Yeah. as pack as if we were moving the entire restaurant here. Ugh. My shoulders are still hurting from the weight of my bag. <laughs> Nina, you look too thin. Have you been eating at all? Yes. Of course, Ma. I can't believe you all made the trip out here. This is unreal. <laughs> Saskia, help carry these things to Mina's room. I'll get it. What is all this stuff? I brought you a few things from home. Thought you could use some new pillows and sheets. Ma, I'm at an inn. We provide all these things. <laughs> some clothes and some medicine. Have you been taking your daily herbs? Hi, dear. Don't mind us. Just get ready for your big day. How are you all here? I mean, this is wonderful, but what about the restaurant? Ah, uh, we just closed it up for a few days. It'll be fine. Our patrons know we can't miss this. <laughs> You're lucky Simon and Saskia pushed so hard. If we held off on deciding one more day, you may have already finished. Well, please sit down and get comfortable. I have to run a few errands before my match, but I'll check in on you soon. Phew, well, we can't sit here either. We have to check in at the other inn and then go get some seats at the Coliseum. You're going to watch too? Hell yeah. Don't worry. Mom won't be able to backseat cook for you all the way from the audience. <laughs> Do we have the same mother? Go on. We'll catch up later. 
Good luck, Mina. Thank you, Ma. Oh. You're awesome. You know that, right? I couldn't let you get into the brigade without a cheering squad. Now I have to make it in. I can't let them down. You are gonna be great. Next time we talk, you'll be a brigadier. Oh. What a lovely family, Yes. I'd be happy to help them if my rooms weren't all taken up. Take a noob. Oh, it's alright. Oh, oh, it's alright. They found a place. I'm just as surprised they all came this way to watch. To see their daughter make it to the big brigade. That could, what could be more worthwhile. <laughs> Take care, Studley. Thank you for hanging out. Yeah, I think I will be... F I'm not sure if I want to finish now or if I want to wait a little bit. Until after this last bite. Let's hope, let's hope what they, uh, that's what they see. I'll do my best. I think my cats can sense that you'll be leaving them soon. I'm getting teary just thinking about it too. Milk your No matter where my work takes me, I'm always going to come back and visit. Besides, Pecorino is too cute to leave behind. <laughs> How about helping me finish these dishes? For one last hurrah? It'd be my pleasure. Hell yeah. Oh shit. Uh So we're gonna need two fires. And a water and a fire? Hmm. <sighs> See if I get a water. It's going to be a level two. I think this is what I have to do for these. Wait, what did I do with that? What? I think I fucked this up. Reset. So I have four of all of them. Try this. Oh, oops. Aha! That's enough. There we go. Oh shit. Wait, how do I... Aha, there we go. So smart. <sighs> um
Oh, what did I do? No, I fucked this up. Hmm. Water for oh, I do have the water for this. There we go. This way. Now we do this. Now we do that. Nice. Damn, these puzzles are not the easiest. Now go on and get your brigade certification and come back soon. You hear? I will. Thank you for all you've taught me, Belchior. Taught you? <laughs> we were just having some fun here cooking. If you learned anything, that's just a nice coincidence. <laughs> you have anything new? Doesn't look like it. Hello? Thorn? Hmm, that's odd. Where did she go? Huh, a note. I've left. The brigade will send an officer to operate as my proxy. Hmm. Don't try to contact me. I'm very busy. And don't touch my babies. I know how every last one of them was left, and if I see so much as a fingerprint on them, I'll take your fingers. I wonder if she's doing some soul searching or just on a mission. Oh, hello there. Looking for work, right? Oh my god, this little boy! That's right. Uh, what happened to Thorn? Oh, beats me. I was too scared to ask. Take your pick of jobs, and I'll ring you up at the end. Hmm. What do we have to do? Oh, just hand the name 15 monsters. Okay. Oh god. Oh my god. Holy shit. Whoa, that was intense. Oh my god! This door!
Okay, needs a heal. Oh my god. Are you fucking kidding? <laughs> this game is so cool. It is. Damn, this is fucking hard, dude. Stop taking damage. These are the fucking. These traps are the fucking worst. Like, they just hit you no matter what, basically. Or at least it feels that way. <laughs> like, no matter what the heck you do, you still get your shit kicked in. Back. Can you let her know Mina Han said thank you for her instruction? Duly noted. Here's your reward, miss. Uh, just one thing. It's probably not my place to say this, but is it alright for you to use that chair of hers? Huh, good point. Good point. I'm gonna need to bring a stool in here. <laughs> It's been a long road for you, hasn't it, Pumpkin? Sent back home and then brought right back in. Hey, thank you, Geek. But here you are, ready to earn your uniform. It's been a whirlwind, that's for sure. <laughs> Once you're ready, let me know and we'll head to the Coliseum. Okay, let's do this real quick. What are you doing here? Shouldn't you be saving all your energy for your big match today? I've got so many nerves running through me. I don't think I can sit still until it's time for my match. <laughs> Besides, cooking for your customers is the perfect warm-up. Well, I'm not going to stop you. Order up! Okay, this. We need Excellent. fire, water, and this. Thank you. This. Mm. Fire and water, water and grass. Oh shit. Uh oh. Oh no. There we go. Delicious. There we go. Poggies. Thank you. Oh, I did that by pure accident. Uh surprisingly good. What am I doing? No, what?
Whoa. Why am I struggling so much with this? Holy shit! I... I got so fucking stuck on that! Oh my lord! I still get 40. Say hello to my sous chef Benly when you make it in, alright? Everyone keeps acting like I'm a sure thing. But sure, I'll try. Don't let our encouragement fool you into thinking it'll be easy. We just believe in you and your work ethic. Oh. You have everything it takes to earn a spot in their brigade. Thank you, Pontita. It's been great working with you. I'm so grateful you took me in. <sighs> it was you that helped me. Now run along. The lunch rush is over. It's time. We're gonna be doing the last duel question mark. We practice. Wait, who do we have to speak to? Oh wait. Oh, I have something new. Oh, the spatula. That's right. No, no, no. Leave. Um. Well, it's been a long, but here you are. It's what? Oh, a challenge. <gasps> It's time. Ready, instructor. Let's break a dish. Um, let's go with the trusty good old thingies. Hasn't failed us yet, except the one time. <laughs> let's go. The family's all there in the back. Hell yeah! Here we stand fellow Victusians on the precipice of greatness. Today our brave challenger is Mina Han of the Windy Village. Let's hear it for the Iron Stomach! Woo! Mina! In order to join the ranks of the Battle Chef Brigade, she must fight her way through one final gauntlet. This bout will consist of three rounds. For each round, Mina must triumph over one of our most formidable Oh, wait, veterans. what? In the spirit of fair play, these veterans will wait several minutes before starting to cook. Mina, are you ready to take Holy on Holy shit, this, this is wild! Yes! Then, without further ado, I summon the final three! Knife! Oh! Spoon! Ooh! Ah! <gasps> the old man! Oh my god! Lieutenants, any words of advice for our chef before you go head to head? Be true to yourself. Of course, you should think about your diner's experience, but make sure you're in love with the dish you're creating. Let's have some fun! The real loser in any cook-off is the one that isn't enjoying themselves. Always have a plan and stay sharp. <laughs> Without focus, any talented chef can lose track of time. Thank you for your wisdom, lieutenants. I shall now impart some of my own. Mina, you may face this challenge by yourself, but you have not walked this path alone. In times of doubt, close your eyes and think of your loved ones. You will find their strength inside of you. Filling your heart I love and the pushing names. you yes. to be your best self. The best chef is the one who understands that bond. One who translates that love into their cuisine. Knife, spoon, and fork. The three lieutenants of the Battleship Brigade. And once we beat them, beat them they will unite into the ultimate life form for the mega fight they will unite into spork <laughs> Mina, in this first round you need only make one dish for our favorite politician ambassador akebo okay so you just need earth i'm no stranger to settling diplomatic disputes but somehow this feels more intense best of luck to you me while surrounded by all this Culinary Let's go. Cover, I'd be remiss not to ask for a bold, fire-laden entree. Oh, he wants fire now. With each round, oh no, he was always fire. Never mind. Judge, and you'll need to cook a dish for each. Please don't forget that. 
We will also connect the magic portals to a different arena per round. Oh my god, every round is gonna be a different map. And they're gonna keep adding judges over time. This is ridiculous. The theme ingredients for this match are special indeed. They represent the most sacred aspects of the brigade. Passion. A brigadier is not simply a chef. They are an ambassador. They spread education and joy where once there was famine and despair. Mm -hmm. The fire in a brigadier's heart is crafted from their never-ending desire to aid others. Spork! There is but one creature in all of Victuja whose fury can match their fire. The merciless dragon! Yes! Oh, we're probably gonna have to kill all of the big bosses for this. Lieutenant Spoon, Lieutenant Fork. If you would please return to your stations until it's time for your matches. A former soldier turned brigadier. Lieutenant Knife is equally adept at satisfying discerning palates and disarming enemies. They call her the Judge's Downfall. On behalf of the Brigade Committee and all of Victuja, Viva Viva the Brigade! Whose cuisine will reign? It's Mina versus Lieutenant Knife. Let's go! Holy shit, she tall. Okay, we need... Oh, we're definitely gonna need some meat from this boy as well. Oh! <laughs> it flew the fuck away! No! Oh, fuck. I... I'm gonna fucking die! I cannot believe this! Nice. Now I want some tomatoes. Where the fuck this boy fucking got far away? Oh. Okay, here we go. This one should be super easy. Barely any convenience. That's it. Wait, let me get rid of this. Are you nervous, Iron Stomach? Are you nervous? <laughs> Good. A nervous chef is a prudent one. I'll take your word for it. Yes! Nice. Gonna need some a little bit more fire. Holy shit, I take so much damage from this.
No, wait, here. Let's wait for this. Get a couple extra points. Oh, sorry. Oh, actually, I can do this. Wait. No, here. Let's get cooking. Nice. I hope I get to keep my ambrosia for next round as well. Or that's gonna be bad. Thank you for your hard work, chefs. Let's see what our judge has to say about your efforts. Ah, <gasps> the spot looks so good. Wow. Sun hat tomato greens with earthen sauce and fiery sauce melange. Breathtaking. You certainly have my boat. 294? Holy shit. Delicious. BBQ Dragon Shank with Dragon Steak and Dragon Heart for lunch. <gasps> yes, we slightly beat it. A meal fit for King Heinrich himself. Okay, that's good. That's a good start. The Iron Stomach's done it. Mina Han wins. Woo! Did it. Just like eleven points. Damn. Beautiful cooking, Mina. I can see the heart you put into the dish. Wow, thank you very much. Mina, you may now take a moment to prepare for round two. We'll begin as soon as you're ready. Uh... I kind of want to replace... The satchel with this. And this with this. It may be. It, I feel like it, this is risky. Like it's a risky strategy. It gives us three super strong tornadoes instead of three basic tornadoes with more slots for food and stuff. Um, but in this, we'll have less HP, but at least if we get knocked out, we won't lose time one time. It's a gamble, but I think it can work. Let round two commence! The two judges Ooh. for the second round are Instructor Meriday. We've seen many excellent dishes this year. This entry must be technically perfect to avoid disqualification. I'm asking for a dish only featuring water. But that means the flavor profile must be perfection. Oh lord. The next judge is... Well, I'm not quite sure who he is. His note just reads... Rudus. Actor. Artist. By the way, Geek, are you back on Kingdom Hearts or are you just chilling and nice stuff? Nice speech there, Cherry. How Those of us left awake are ready for some good eats. <laughs> <laughs> These muscles don't feed themselves, you know. Body by earth and water, my friends. Water and earth water. The you face is known for turning simple meals into exquisite works of art. Diners are always in store for an extraordinary experience with the transformative gastronomer, Lieutenant Spoon. We now turn our attention to this round's theme ingredient, resilience. A brigadier understands their limits, but seeks endlessly to test them. While they may falter when beset with a seemingly impossible task, Nevertheless, they persevere. Hell yeah. No monster tests a contestant's dexterity better than this next adversary. A being so oh, nice. impregnable, it's as solid as the mountains themselves. Only a true battle chef can overcome the unyielding armor rock. Oh, we're making turtle? Is turtle boys. Chefs, begin! Okay. Dual 2 with Lieutenant Spoon. We need a bunch of water. Water and water and water, water, water and water and water, water, water and water and water, water, water and water and water, water. Oh fuck. Uh actually, this can help. Never mind. Damn it. 
Let me up. Hello? There we go. Wait, no, come to me. Oh, wait, my own tornado is hitting me? I didn't know that could happen. What? I did not know my own tornado can fucking kill me. Uh. Okay, Satchel can carry a lot of things. So let's begin uh, with the mainly water dish. Or water and earth dish. Um... Oh shit. No, wait, what did I do? Oh, I don't know what I'm doing. Oh god. Whatever. Do that. Let's see what happens, I guess. Oh, actually that works too. Okay, we have two words. We just need a bit more water. Okay, now we need something that's only water. You're just like me then. Trust in yourself and you'll bring something new and beautiful to our culinary landscape. I'll do my best. Yes. Okay, okay, okay. So you need just water. Anything I can get that only has water. Um, <laughs> hmm. 
No. Okay, that's pretty good. <clears throat> Okay, let me get rid of this, and then has water and thing for him, and this is mostly water for her. <sighs> okay, okay, okay. It's been a fun stream. Most definitely we'll be getting Thank the game. Hell yeah! Hard work, chefs. I'm glad. Let's see what the judges have to say about your efforts. Oh, I did a very similar dish for both. Dang it. Lovely. Slime water mochi. Topped with watery sauce and skull breast assortment. 254, damn. You certainly adapted the water. Adapted well, the water brings a freshness without adding unnecessary density. Scrumptious. There's a place at the academy for you should you ever choose to enroll. Wait, this is for Spoon though. Spoon is already a lieutenant. Amrog chopped flat noodles with liver and skull taste medley. Okay, this was certainly the weakest one. There wasn't a lot of water that I could knew how to find. Fantastic. Candle gourd lava cake. Holy shit, how do I beat this? Okay, I think mine was better. Hey, you got some earth of water in there, huh? Wow, no pinky cake. Wait, that's not how this works? <laughs> 502, oh fuck. This has to be very good. <gasps> Is that enough? I think that's enough. Seconds, please? <gasps> Wait! How much did she have? Another stunning victory. <gasps> oh Guys. my god, that was down to the fucking wire. Mina Ha wins. <laughs> Ten points. The previous one was eleven. Oh my god, chat. It's down to the fucking wire. You definitely got what it takes. I'll be rooting for you. Thank you, Lieutenant Spoon. I'm honored. You are almost there, Mina. Take one last moment to prepare. And then the match that decides it all will begin. Uh, not the biggest fan of this. <laughs> Gonna take this back. And HP. <laughs> um. I want to change this for anything. I don't think so. Uh, is there anything that's better than this? Um, I guess I'll keep the rainbow droplets instead of this. Because I don't think I ne I've needed as many combo thingies, and it's kind of difficult to use. Slime Cormorong. Oh my god, that looks so extra! Have you ever seen this, by the way, Agent? Does it seem interesting to you? It's a fantastic game, we'd surely recommend. Oh, <gasps> he's a judge now! Is Pontita. 
Discipline's hammer. Oh my god, Imp wanted the Enthorn? Oh shit, we're gonna be making food for them. German, Mina, ignore any distractions and focus on your work. Oh shit! Lieutenant, I look forward to seeing your skill in person. Seen it played a few times, nice. I'm not one for exotic tastes and fine dining. Bring me an earth dish worthy of the brigade, but suitable for my crescent regulars. Earth, okay. In keeping with our traditions, I will serve as first judge of this final match. I've watched your skill grow with each match. It is my honor to test your merit. Mm -hmm. It's a chairman's privilege to request a taste profile as resplendent as himself. An unusual dish that harnesses all flavors in a powerful rainbow gem. That is what I ask of you. Oh! And on my left, Thorn the Blight Stalker. Holy shit, he wants a perfect match of all three things. Mm -hmm. Right. Bring me a dish worthy of my trophy wall. And don't disappoint me. Too many times in life I've saw oh, shit. only to catch fire and crash back into the unforgiving ground. Give me something that makes me relive. This is so fucking hard. And earth. Preferably a good pairing with dwarven red. For our final theme ingredient, we plunge from the highest of heights into the deepest depths to discover the last piece of Brigadier Philosophy. Shit. Unity. Lurking beneath the molten lakes of the caverns, the final theme ingredient is one that displays just how much scarier two heads are than one. Oh, the Hydra! And how truly terrifying six can be. The brigade could not stand if every member didn't work together, regardless of their role, their background, their skill. Those adventurous enough to trek deep into the mountains oh, fuck. will come face to face with Victuja's master mutator, the deceptive Hydra. Oh god. It's time to go all out. Chefs, stun us with your visionary creations. Let the final round begin. Oh lord. Oh, oh, holy shit, we have 12 minutes. The game knows. Okay, this earth is gonna be great. I'm already taking damage, fuck. Oh! Get hit by the fucking tornado. Okay, I'll take those. I do need a piece of the fucking Hydra. Oh. Uh. Shit! Fucking stop! Fuck! Oh my god. Oh, I'm so stressed. Okay, I'm gonna... Fuck! Stop dying! Oh no! Oh, I'm already wasting so much time. Shit. Shit on a brick. I need to bring this all back. Drop those there. <sighs> Come on, they did they. 
shit, shit, shit. Please die. Yes! Okay, okay, that's good. That's good. I should have enough pieces. Okay, so first for the earthy piece. Uh, Hydra. Actually, let's just do Hydra and Egg. Uh, and then we're gonna add a bunch of these. Actually, get rid of the bones. Do I not have more? Okay. Okay, just want to get a bunch of these shroom thingies. I know there's some here. We can just chuck these inside this. Where are they? Uh, shrooms. Oh shit. That's it. Come on, come on. Okay, okay. Do you have any more earth? I could just like dump in here, sure. Okay, you're good enough. You know my parents came from a small village like yours. I do not fucking care about the water. Mm -hmm. always I do not care about the fire. Some fire is fine. Okay, there we go. Oh fuck, I still need to make two different dishes now! Fuck! <laughs> Quite so. Uh, hydro lungs. Uh and I'm gonna need some water. I'm gonna need one more water and earth. Okay, I'm gonna put this here, and when this is done, I will turn it in. And then I will put the other one to cook. Uh, now I need ingredients for the other stuff. Holy shit, okay. My dear god. Ooh. Okay, this is good enough. I want that there. And I want one that's mostly earth. And water. And fire, sorry. Do I not have another piece of the Hydra that's better for this? Awesome. Um, shit, 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 uh... 
Okay, let me drop this in here. And I'm gonna need the slightest other bit of this. Okay, I have a bunch of fire. Gonna need more earth. Perfect. Okay, now I need some more earth. I need more earth! Oh god. Oh jeez. Okay, so wait, so this has three, three, and three. This is amazing for you. Um. So that has the same amount of those. Some of that. I need just a little bit more earth. Please cook as fast as you f humanly fucking can. We can add these just for the shits and giggles. Oh my god, I think we can do it, chat! I just need one more level 3 earth. Let's go. Oh, please tell me this is good enough. <gasps> Thank you for your hard work, chefs. Let's see what the judges have to say about your efforts. <sighs> this is the end chat. Oh my god, this all looks amazing. Wonderful. Slime Cormorang with Crackmore Claw and Crackmore Shell Melange. The earth in this dish is phenomenal. Even my pickiest regulars would be pleased. I'd offer you a job immediately, but your talent will take you far greater places than my humble crescent. I wish you nothing but the best. 244, okay. Truly commendable. Steamed Hydro Rolls with Quarry Cap and Burskid Tail Melange. 210? Wait, I forget, is that better or worse than his? The earth in this dish is phenomenal, even my peak is- yeah, yeah, yeah. Expertly done. I'd be proud to serve this to my customers. Transcendent. Iceberg turnip pie with a side of hydroneck and loopier bla bladder melange. Holy shit, that looks amazing. It is exactly as I wished. Rainbow is the um, disputed star of the, ra of the dish. Magnificent. You've raised the bar of excellence with each new dish. 459. Hydra steamed rounds with Hydra neck and Burskit meat medley. Oh! Mine is way better. It is exactly as I wished. The flavors are absolutely stunning and I could gaze at your plating all day. I don't have a single complaint. Oh! Yes, good. 
Holy shit, okay, we have some advantage. Going into the last dish. We had 485. He has 459. So we have like, what? 26 points? Yes, 26 points of advantage. Lupier, Fire, Vladder, Meatloaf with a side of Crackball. <gasps> Wait, this doesn't have Hydra. The fire on Earth, the burn, the pain, I remember. Every monster is perfectly prepared. All the hunting really paid off. Wait, it doesn't have Hydra. Whatever. I approve. Hydra fin soup topped with quarry cap and the pure bladder assortment. <gasps> I think we win! <laughs> I think we win! The fire in the earth. I, I incredible. I'll flee anyone who attempts to take this dish from me. <gasps> Java! Wait, was that enough? And with that, <laughs> the Iron Stomach earns her place in the brigade. <laughs> Holy shit! <gasps> oh my fucking god! Sweet Christ on Earth! Oh my god! Hey Jova, how you doing? <laughs> Welcome on in! You absolute delight! Also, I saw your outfit today on uh, Twitter. Hicking amazing. Very gay, very cute. Love it. Oh my fucking god. I was so nervous we would have to redo this and it would take like half an hour. <laughs> it is my joy to present Mina Han, our newest brigadier. Woo! Alright! 744 to 708! Let's go! Oh my god! Hydra Steam Browns, Hydra Fin Soup, and Steam Hydra Rolls. I knew when I saw that spark in your eye that we were <sighs> And I'm glad that I wasn't let down. Mina Han, well done. Well done indeed. Yeah! Welcome to the brigade! I think I got halfway through this game. Oh my god, Joa, it's so good. I was moved watching you cook. Every chef should have as much determination as you do. Was it because you didn't like it too much, or got distracted, or was it too hard, or something? Thank you, lieutenants. Very I curious. Can't wait to begin working. Everyone, please put your hands together for our newest battle chef, Mina Han. She did it. I know she can do it. <laughs> Go, Mimi. Go, Mimi. <laughs> oh, let's go! This year's tournament has to have been our fiercest yet. I am so proud of all our contestants. The way our country's chefs fought back the monster epidemic was swift and decisive. Even now, our team is hard at work continuing to figure out the cause and the solution. Every one of the chefs before me took part in the safety of our people. Putting aside their own hopes and dreams for the tournament. Today we Hell celebrate yeah. the new members of the Battle Chef Brigade. They will go on to be ambassadors, protectors, providers, researchers, and pioneers. Ladies and gentlemen, your new Battle Chefs! And so, Mina joined the ranks of the Battle Chef Brigade. And it was the happiest moment of her life. <laughs> Unfortunately, she had no time to rest on her hard-won laurels. The mystery of the mutation still loomed overhead. As it cut a swath throughout Victusia, the mutation touched many lives. <gasps> oh, we were in Chapter 4? I didn't even realize. I thought we were in 3. <laughs> in Blossom. Oh! Nothing from Ardia today. I hope the kids aren't giving her too much trouble. What am I saying? They better watch out for her! <laughs> yup! This is the point where we're gonna stop, and tomorrow we're gonna come back to... Uh... Or start Dead Space 2. You play as Thrash now for... I think the rest of the game. And figure out what all of that 
uh, dark area stuff was. Uh, he has a different gameplay style than Mina's. Different combat. Different abilities. Uh, and all sorts of nonsense. And it's amazing. So I'm hoping it, it'll be a bit of a... A bit of a cliffhanger. <laughs> uh, but it's also a great stopping point. Because Mina finally got into the brigade. And now the story will continue. Some other time. <laughs> uh, I mostly just got distracted. I have it on Steam, but it's hard for me to play games on my Surface. That is a big win to end it on. Yeah, because I'm usually doing other things when I'm using it. Yeah, that's entirely fair. This is a great... Uh, this is a great Switch game. Like, I convinced... I think I convinced Tealeaf to get it for Switch, and pretty much already convinced also uh, uh, Geek <laughs> to do that as well. Daily Cook-Off, you can play as three different characters with different abilities and stuff. You have local multiplayer. You have challenges. I haven't tried any of this. What are the extras? Oh, gallery. I don't know how you unlock this stuff. And play, I think this is just for the story. So, I don't know, let's say we do daily cook-off. Oh, I see. So the daily cook-off gives you randomly just, these are the judges, this is what they want, this is what the thing has to be, this is who you compete against, so basically the AI, how good it is. Uh, and these are the items you have at your disposal and you have to just figure stuff out so it's like an entirely random every day you get to just play and see what happens everything pre-selected for you so that looks pretty fun like you play with thrash and it's similar different ingredient apparently uh but all the same loadout neat Love it. Oh, Sam played it? Makes sense. Sam would... If there's a few streamers that would... I would think would have somehow heard about this game and tried it out and stuff, it would be Blip. <laughs> uh, I miss Blip. Uh, let me put some... Yes, like real quick. Uh, but yeah, fantastic game. Fully recommended to anyone. We will stop it for now and come back and finish it after Dead Space. We'll do Dead Space tomorrow, especially because my voice has been not happy with how much I've been reading, <laughs> I guess. Because uh, it has a lot of voice acting, but it also has a lot of reading. Uh, so hoping that tomorrow will be fine, since Dead Space 2 is fully voice acted, AAA game, uh, and stuff. Uh, hopefully it will be fine. If not, we may have to make it a shorter stream. Uh, especially tired my voice today, because I also like played the new DVD thing like I mentioned earlier. Uh, there's new content with a new killer, new map, new survivor, and all that stuff. And I played some with Nice as well for a few hours. So I was on. I've been talking for most of the day. <laughs> uh, did a playthrough, nice. Uh, but yeah, thank you all for coming in. Sorry, Jova, that you, you popped by right as we were finishing. I hope everything's going fine. Going well. Uh. I don't remember exactly, I don't know if you told me exactly when the internship starts, but I hope if it's soon that it goes great, and if not, that it goes great either way. <laughs> uh, again, probably back tomorrow with starting Dead Space. Uh, I'll be off Thursday and Friday probably, I think I need to rest my voice. Uh, and on Thursday I'm not streaming, but I will be on call with friends, uh, so <laughs> yeah. Uh, and there's a chance I'll also be hanging out with someone on Saturday before stream as well, so 
I, I really need to find Windows to rest my voice. Because <laughs> it's not used to speaking this much, that's for sure. Uh, so yeah, we'll go back to, to Spoops with Dead Space 2. Uh, don't think that should take longer than Prey. Also, for those that missed Prey and want to see it, and may want to see this as well, I think tomorrow I will start downloading things and uploading them to YouTube again with the Prey playthrough and this. Uh, and, uh, yeah. We're kind of started already. Right now we're just testing things out and figuring out how things work. In a couple of weeks, though, we'll officially start the study. Gotcha. Best of luck, Joe. I hope you have the best fun. Sounds super neat. Uh, anything else I need to say? If you haven't, uh, feel free to join the Discord. I update there. All things stream. What we're gonna do, when, how. Uh, live notifications, all that nonsense. Uh, I put my review of kind of the first time I quote unquote really had Taco Bell. I had it once before, but it was many years ago and I didn't remember anything about it. Um, but this was the first time I like asked people like, hey, what should I get? And tried actual Taco Bell. Uh, and I put my thoughts in there. <laughs> Along with a couple pictures. Um, and uh, yeah, I appreciate you all. Thank you for hanging out. And we'll be reading Misubi, who's doing some arts. Or was doing some arts last time I saw. Yeah, doing some 3D art for Red Cat. Should be neat. Uh, take care. Y'all are great. Appreciate each and every one of you. Uh, hopefully see you tomorrow. If not, that's, that's fine. Uh, take good care, get some rest, do all the things you need to do, you're doing great, and then uh, we'll be seeing you around. We'll be reading fairly quickly, because I'm pretty tired. <laughs> uh, but yeah, thank you for hanging out, love y'all. Bye! Oh, and this is the right message. I forgot. <laughs> <laughs> hey Will, thank you for hanging out, Agent. It's always lovely. Good seeing you. I appreciate you.